Ma ah. Come on, like our VTube studio cooperating. We're so we're so we had all day to figure this out. It's fine. We good. Uh-oh. Tracking's being weird today. Let's see. One sec. Double check. Being tracked okay. Yeah, okay. Looks like it's fine. Looks like it's just being a little... YouTube Studio being a funky little guy. I think it's actually my iPad, uh, since I've used my iPad. Just not used to being on for this long. Also, Pan <laughs> Pan Python, welcome in. Hi. And hi, Xavier, what's up? There we go. Okay. Johnny, yeah, VTube Studio being a little quirky. I think it's actually my iPad because I usually use my phone for tracking. However, my uh, it got so hot last week, the arm that holds up my phone broke. And so I have to use my iPad instead. So good thing I had a backup camera, but also I don't think it's used to doing this yet. Got to get with the program. I know I was using it as an art tablet but it's gotta become a, a facial capture software right now, so. We adapt. We adapt and hope for the best. <laughs> hey, Zero! How is iPad tracking? It's about the same as iPhone tracking. Uh, the main difference is uh, <laughs> I don't need to mount it. I can just have my iPad case prop itself up and it's about the same eye level. Uh, tracking wise, I think because I've been using my phone, uh, it's a little more accustomed to my face movements, but it's a, the, Apple's phones are weird, especially with their face recognition, because it gets better the more you use it. So, this is a pretty fresh camera. Green appreciated nerd. 180%ed a level 5 hype train while I was busy being scuffed. Y'all are too nice, my gosh. Janowski. I saw, I saw that. I saw that. Thank you for the thousand and I'm, I saw more. Gosh. Let me just uh, finish up that train real quick. You didn't have to do that. You didn't have to do that. Hi, Neko. How are you doing? How are you? I hope you're doing well. Also, I forgot that I turned down my motion by a lot. <laughs> my, uh, my motion's turned down a little bit. Oh, that's okay. That's actually fine. I will, I will survive. Portal, hi! Just got here, looks at stream title, puts on shades and sets. Lifeguard here on duty. <laughs> Mwah. We're here for swimsuit art today. Let's go, it's hot. I want I want to go out and get some new swimsuits, but I haven't had time to go shopping. I've had family over. Oh, and I've been working on a lot of stuff behind the screen. screen. Also, Martian! Hi, Martian! How are you? I'm so sorry I missed the raid. Um, I hope you're doing well. <laughs> I know, I'm so behind on, on the, the notification. <laughs> so I'm sorry. Hi, Martian. What are you doing? What were you doing? Mr. Munzee, just want you to know I was stressed as hell because of stuff outside of my control. Your stream is relieving it greatly. Of course. I'm, I'm glad just vibing here is helping. I would hope it wouldn't add to anything. Yeah, they didn't have to, but they did anyways because they get love nerd. <laughs> I have to... I have to... To accept kindness. It's so hard. Why is it so hard? Uh, hey, Fancy, what's up? 
Honey, you're always late on the notifications. That is true. I'm always late with the notifications. I'm never not late. That's, um... It's actually a family tree. <laughs> I learned that it's pretty common for my family to be late to things. I think it's because my mom, every time we had to leave the house at, like, 6, we would get ready five minutes before 6 to leave. That was not a good habit to build in us, mom. But now I gotta, I gotta right the wrongs of my predecessors, you know? Train myself to be better and not be late to my own stream that I schedule myself. <laughs> One day. One day. They will get there. Ah. Nekos and I will be busy drawing, so we'll draw together. <gasps> we'll just... <laughs> oh. Draw together? Neko, just a little, like, doodle buddies? We're gonna be doodle buddies? I love that. He'll draw with me. Makes me so happy. <laughs> Mormon standard time. <laughs> Does that mean you're now a modern Disney character? Breaking the circle and all that. You know, Disney's influenced me. I'm gonna be better than the past generations, but also we're gonna heal from the... the generational trauma <laughs> that was leaving five minutes before we're supposed to be at a different location. <laughs> also, Kevin Ward, thank you for the gifted sub. What else? Hey, thank you for the resub. Happy eight months. Let's go. He's not gonna get his own swimsuit. <gasps> With a little lad in shorts. You know? Don't want him to be indecent on the beach. You're becoming more and more jummy. <laughs> Maybe jummy is becoming more and more me. Ever think of that? Huh? Huh? That's no, definitely the other way around. Jummy's definitely influencing me. <laughs> but how would a boy wear shorts? We're not gonna revive this. Actually, no. We will. It, it's it's around the hips. Why would a, why would a little lad have it around his front little toesy woesies? Why would he have them on the front? That's when you put the shirt on. It becomes a full outfit, not a- w You don't wear pant extra pant legs over your arms, do you? If someone does, actually. Please put that in my Discord. I want to see that. I want to see that. <laughs> Their front toes, you said it. I misspoke and I'm paying the price. Ugh. How oh, dare. Also, Jasper, thank you. My pats, my consolation for- Eating my own words, I guess. <laughs> All right, Cobra, thank you for the resub. Happy 13 months. Did they say 13 is an unlucky number? Feeling pretty lucky if we got a swimsuit. Art. Yes, swimsuits. I want to draw swimsuits so bad. It's been getting hot, and I want to go for a swim. Ooh, I really hope I'm not missing Martian's messages. <laughs> I think we're good. I think we're good. Also, I'm so sorry I'm not really not keeping up with chat. I'm trying to say thank you and keep up at the same time. <laughs> also, jolly cooperation. Cooperation. <laughs> thank you for the gifted sub to Celtic Link. Anonymous. Wait a minute. Thank you for the gifted sub to Honey Goblin. I haven't found out. I'm an imposter. The, the real honey goblin just got gifted a sub <laughs> from my channel. <laughs> Amazing. Amazing. Also, hydrophobic sheep, thank you for the resub. Happy three months. Welcome back. Lemming boy, thank you for the resub. Whoop whoop. Six months. Six months. Oh, that's half a year. That's half a year. Oh, Super Zimbu, thank you for the resub. Happy eight months. Oops, swimsuit art? Mm hmm, mm hmm. Patience. Patience, my friend. We'll get there soon. Kevin Ward, thank you for the. Oh, five gifted subs. Oh my gosh. Mr. Root, thank you for the hundred. Oh gosh. Next, just want to say I'm glad I found your channel. Love your content. Thank you. I'm, I'm glad you like it. It's a lot of me just fumbling around trying to do art and not get nervous. It be what it be. <laughs> Hi, Zapchat. How's it going? 
<sighs> okay. Whew. Getting hot. I, I can't let my brain fry. Let's take that. Let's take that. Hydrate real right now. I don't know. Why did I chew that water? <laughs> you don't chew water. Come on, brain. Let's go. Zulangar, welcome back. Happy half a year. And Janowski, thank you for the 750, the 1,750 things. So much. Grubnut, thank you so, so much. Stride, thank you. Zyphonia, thank you so much. I'm so sorry I missed your messages. Where's my yeet redeem? Ooh, did it not show up? It should. Do I want to test it? Nope, redeems are working for me anyways. I get old chewy water. Isn't that just like coconut water? Pretty good. I've had it. It's not bad. It's uh get used to swallowing chunky water. It's weird. Also, breadstick, thank you for the resub. Happy 13 months. And Zavarin, thank you for the two months. Welcome back. Hope you're having a good Friday. I don't know why I struggled to read that so much. Jeez, Death, thank you for the hundred shinies. And Omar, thank you for the hundred. Oh my gosh. Stop. Ah, bit sleepy. I just got home from work. Now it's my weekend off. <gasps> weekend off. Here, I can't make it to today's stream. Family stuff, but came to wish you good vibes and have a great stream. Thank you. I hope you have fun with your family. <laughs> okay, let's take this off. We're gonna we're gonna focus. We're gonna get back to focusing. <clears throat> Just making sure I didn't miss anything. Yeah, okay, cool. I have, I have the redeem in front of me now. Jasper, oh my gosh, Jasper, you redeemed everything today. Oh my gosh. Thank you for the breathe redeem. <sighs> Down alert, super quiet again? All right. Let's see. What if I turn them all the way up? 100% up. Oh, just kidding. I know what it is. My wisest moments uh, this morning, I turned down my entire computer volume because I didn't want Because I listened to a lot of J-Rock really early in the morning to pump me up. 9 a.m. <laughs> And I had to turn it down because I don't want my neighbors hearing it. I don't think they would appreciate J-Rock first thing in the morning, you know? That's a, that's a choice that I wish not to inflict upon other people. Also, Jasper, thank you for the ear I wonder if I can... I've been rigging uh, Sir Elk's model today, and I'm like, what if I could... ...myself more control? More ear control. That's for later. That's for, that's a later thing. <clears throat> Excuse me. Pulpy water's not water? It's got water in the name. What do you mean it's not water? Alright. Gecko, thanks for the focus. Alright, we got a song redeem. Excellent. Now I'm just thinking about J-Rock. I've been listening to uh, Hatsune Miku today. And it's her, some, I don't like the auto-tune of her old stuff, but like, her new stuff. Real good, sad, vocaloid music. All right, <clears throat> excuse me. Just gonna drink something and then we're gonna sing our future.
I had to go Can't you hear me? I'm not coming home Do you understand? I've changed my plan Cause I I'm in love With my future Can't wait to meet her And I I'm in love But not with anybody else Wanna get to I know supposedly I'm lonely now I know I'm supposed to be unhappy without someone But aren't I someone? I like to be your answer Cause you're so handsome But I know better than to drive you home Cause you'd invite me in And I'd be yours again But I I'm in love with my future, and you don't know her. And I, I'm in love, but not with anybody here. I'll see you in a Thank you, Gecko. I really appreciate that. It does help me focus a bit. A bit. A lot. Uh, focus. Words in front of me. And back. Thanks for the hydrate. <gasps> yes. More water. And the posture check. Oh, this is good. My arm's been cramping up. I slept really weirdly on my neck yesterday, so... It's been affecting my arm. Oh, all right. Whew. Thanks, Ghost of Evelyn. Oh yeah, Nights, uh, that is by Billie Eilish, called My Future. Been feeling a lot lately, just trying to keep my expectations for myself tempered, you know? Sometimes I put a little too much on my plate and that's my own fault, but we learn, we grow, we get better. Be a little bit close. And Johnny, thanks for another posture check. I missed that earlier. The neck out. Janowski, guess what? I got a, that job I interviewed for. <gasps> you got the job? You're a working boy, but you know what that means? You can save up and treat yourself to something nice, like a new video game? Yeah? Right? Right? <laughs> Come on! Come on! You just got your job! Janowski. It's oh, a lot. 
Also, gravy protector. Happy 10 months. How's it going? It... It's going. <laughs> it's going. It's going. Thank you for the 50 gifted subs. Oh gosh, that's so that's so much. I'm trying not to scream. I'm trying so hard not to scream. And just in case it my mic picks it up and it blows out your little eardrums. Next, love that song is my favorite. It's a very fun one to sing, you right. <laughs> Ooh. All right, let me let me let me take a sec to breathe. Turtle hat, do you do commissions and where does one go into ordering? If you do exclamation point commissions, and actually see my website and prices, but they are closed currently. I'm working on some models. Oh. Okay. Supporting Gobby's Mitri. <laughs> you didn't have to do that. Neko, honey, the first paycheck is spent on what you want to spend it on. <sighs> You're right. I, that's just a lot. That's just a lot. <laughs> I love that. Better follow up. When do we get merch? Not sure. Honestly, uh, I wanted to pace myself because I've I've heard about so many horror stories when it comes to merch, where people have ordered things but the manufacturer was kind of shady and doesn't deliver it. Then there's also the quality to look into and whether it's ethically ethically sourced. I've been trying to contact Makeship for a little while, but they haven't gotten back to me, so I'm gonna probably plushies might be a bit more of a wait. Um, but for the most part, some small things might be fun. Mm -hmm. Saw that oof was available to me for the first time, so I had to go for it. Saw an opportunity. Took it. You did it. Let me just double check that I have the right file open and I don't have secret projects open. Lip Studio. Because that would be a little bit of a spoiler. I don't want to spoil something before it's a done. Moments later. All right, all right, we'll get to art. We'll get to art. Don't worry, don't worry. All right, what's it? I've been really feeling this lately. This might be a bit loud, so uh, bear with me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna turn that right down. <laughs> uh, my ears. <sighs> Listen, this is coming through my headphones. Can you hear that? That hurt. <laughs> All right, cool, cool. Let my let my ears recover for a sec. Oh, I forgot to turn out my headphones. Nope, that's up. Sick. It's still loud, but um. Yeah, that'll loop. That'll loop. <laughs> Very nice headphones. Thanks. I stole them from Cove. <laughs> They're not actually mine. I don't want to be fully deaf. Yeah, I'm so sorry. That was um, that was 100% my bad. I forgot that in turning up my volume for sound alerts, it also turns up the volume for my soundtrack. <laughs> One sec. I gotta. I gotta breathe again. <laughs> I'm sweating through my shirt. <laughs> these, these bring, <laughs> when you flashbang yourself, happens way too often. It happens so often with me. Whew. I saw, did I wake you up? I'm so sorry. Destin the Insane, thank you for the resub. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Also, geez, death, thank you so much. Man, I got her face at work, you know what that means. I gotta throw more shine at you. This one's sweet. You don't have 
have to, but I, I, I'm just happy that you're working in regular hours that are actually like okay for you. <laughs> also, Blaze, thank you so much. Panic, got what my mouse is attached to. Blaze, thank you. <laughs> you're a wonderful person, an artist, and an inspiration to many. We love and keep being you. Also, someone threw a Kofi at me, and I completely flashbang myself, so I missed that. I'm so sorry. <sighs> Night Hunter. I don't play Monster Hunter, no. Monster Hunter sounds like a lot of fun. I've seen a lot of uh, my friends play it, but... Switch over to art before I get too distracted. Yeah, there we go. And suits. And some are a bit low. Just this. Oh, you know what it might have been? Uh, it might have been the Windows update. Okay, that could. Yeah, everything's way louder than it should be. Oh, Windows made everything so much louder. <laughs> Woo! Should be fine now? Now it's a bit too loud? Okay. Much better? Okay, sick. I am so sorry about that. That's my mistake. I think the Windows update messed up my sound settings. Windows loves to update while I'm asleep. That's what it do. So much like a honey goblin gag reel. You mean a regular stream? It's just every day. Ooh. It'd be a pretty funny twist if Honey couldn't actually see highlight messages on her end. That would be pretty funny, but I do. It just means that I'm actually really bad at reading chat. I'm sorry. <laughs> Should be gaming. Hey, welcome in. YouTube recommended a random clip of Honey to me. I'm sorry. <gasps> Which led me down the path of discovering VTubing and VR stuff overall. She's inspiring. Thank you. There's so many cool VTubers out there. Ah. <sighs> But yeah, I'm very interested in VR. I want to get into it. It's I, I got other stuff I got to do first. I got to pace myself. Can't keep adding more things later and later. Also, Critic of Innocence, thank you for the reason. So what drink is needed for eight months? Ooh. I'm a little biased. I always like me. It's just, it's, it's good. It's good. Janowski. I know I didn't have to, I definitely wanted to. Your stream has been such a positive influence in my life and the lives of so many people here. Honestly, I've been spiraling out of control recently and your relentless positivity and the atmosphere of comfort and genuine support has really helped me to pull out of my nosedive. I really mean it when I say that you are very important to a lot of people. You really do deserve the relentless love and support you get from us. Thank you. I'm so glad you're doing better, Genesis. I'm like, I'm really also, congratulations again on getting a job. Like, I'm glad the interview went well. It's always a good feeling. But yeah. <laughs> Y'all also just radiate a lot of positive energy, so it's not just me. Y'all bring good energy here. Death is my first real weekend in two months. Trust me when I say no one is happier about my return to normal hours than me. Oh yeah, I can definitely see why. You. How are you doing, Poffle? Yeah, go. Now, how is chat going to distract you tonight? They already are. They already are. Why is your store always out of stock? I have too much gold. I know. Don't worry. After the break, I will be adding a lot more redeems, and you might run out of gold pretty quickly. <laughs> Neko, honey, you're cute, and this is not a distraction. I don't believe you. I don't believe you, Neko. Oh, sweet pea, Neko. I don't believe you when you say it's not a distraction. All right, let's let's do some swimsuits. <laughs> really, One Piece, the anime? Let's go, let's move. Start 
It's a good anime. Actually, no, it's a, it's a... The first season's a real slog. It's it's old style anime, which is very slow, very long. The bomb is good. Hope I'm good, honey. How's you? I'm doing good. I'm just whipping up some swimsuit concepts. Just cause. I haven't drawn a lot of swimsuits in summers. It's half over now, I think. You wouldn't know it from how hot it is, but it is very, very warm right now. So I'm gonna take advantage of it and draw swimsuits. Dingus, thank you for the gift. It's up to Popful. I need to look over there. Distraction. Come on. No, come on. <laughs> Voxel Industrial, thank you for the resub with Prime. Welcome back. Happy six months. PayPal's kind of bored, so Prime will have to do that. That's, that's already plenty. That's very kind of you to give you Prime sub over. I mean, what is the canvas? I destroyingly white. Because it felt like. Nah, I can change it to gray. I usually have it gray, but I figured it'd be fun to have it white for every once in a while. Apparently it's not built for uh, people who don't use light mode. I do not actually. Kobe uses light mode and I don't know how her eyes handle it. We're gonna see abs? Maybe just a little bit? Maybe just a little bit of abs? As a tweet? Yeah? Dude, imagine how you're not being constantly bombarded with love and affection before she gets work done. Can you imagine? I would actually get art done. What would, where would I be then? What would happen to me? What kind of person would I be if I actually got art done at a uh, reasonable pace? That's a pretty neutral pose. I think we can zhuzh it up a little bit. Contrapost this baby. I will shame Cove later. Oh, you cannot shame the shameless. She doesn't mind that her she reads in light mode. Cringe it or something. She's acceptable. I feel like Gabi would definitely use light mode just to make people. Oh, one hundred percent. Gabi would do it for the memes. Ah, oh, I love Gabi. Her commitment to every bit is just, ah, so funny, so good. Neko, well, I'm distracted too. I must draw tomorrow, important day, and I must have it ready. <gasps> tomorrow. Oh no. I know tomorrow I'm playing Path, playing, uh, <laughs> I'm doing Path of Pain tomorrow. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> Real folks, please. Hope you get a Nendroid one day, because I'd buy the shit out of that. I'll buy two and put one on my dashboard, assuming it wouldn't melt. Even if this, if this is kind of your summer theme. That would be really cool. I don't know how, like, I have no idea how to go about getting a Nendroid. I thought about at one point applying for Vshoujo, but their applications opened when I was, like, just starting streaming. And I was like... Nah, those are a bunch of pretty ladies. I'm just a little gremlin and they I'm not as funny as them. They're all so good at memeing and staying relevant and I'm just here drawing silly little, silly little drawing. Heck, oh, I love Path of Pain, honey, 2020. You know what the sad thing is though? I can't remember a lot of it. That's the that's the scary thing though. I was I was backtracking and I was like, you know, what do I remember about Path of Pain? And there's just nothing. Nothing in my brain. So either I have not actually played Path of Pain, or I thought I did, or I have, and my memories just completely blocked it. We're gonna find out tomorrow. It'll be fun. Bro, use a lovely goblin girl. <laughs> You see that. Y'all better be taking care of yourself first. No excuses. <laughs> Little pizza slices. 
That's all I can think of when I draw pointy ears like this. No pizza slice. How many times must we remind you that you're a cutie, goddamn? How many times we gotta teach you this lesson, old man? You gotta get Vishojo to want you. True. Yeah. Ninjag, Path of Pain is a side quest, kind of, in Hollow Knight that is extremely difficult and it's a lot of platforming and painful. That be it. Best Green Gremlin has a festival. Thank you, Nika. Welcome in, by the way. Our new Hachikoma, thank you for 13 months. Welcome back. Swim suit, let's go. Let's go. Pathfinder! Thank you for the prime. Happy four months. Welcome back. Ooh. Love a happy little fan base that loves gobs. Soon the world will understand and stand gobby supremacy. The day will truly. Watch one day, honey will become Queen of E Shoujo. I was genuinely surprised that Zentrea knew who I was. Same thing with Project Melody. I was very surprised um, that Mel was aware of my existence, and I was like, oh. Oh no. <laughs> what does this mean? The senpais know who I am? Uh oh, uh oh. I gotta be on my best behavior now. <laughs> Your memory's blocked because it's too painful. Quite possible. Quite possible. Good question. When did you start streaming? I started streaming. Uh, I believe it was May 2021? Or no, it was April, I believe. Yes, it was April 26th, I think, was my first stream. So it has been a year and a couple months. I, uh, <laughs> I was very fortunate. A lot of, a lot of the audience or the viewership that I got was due to luck. So it's a... It was a very strange situation. I was not expecting someone to share my play model on a iFunny of all places, and uh, apparently that's uh, people were very aware of my debut. Honey, she'll take over the world slowly but surely. Nah, it'll be like it'll be like a, a, a jelly trying to just cross the street. I'm I, I I'm too I'm too passive about it. <laughs> Supernova Fox, big lurker here. Appreciate the comfy wipes. Thank you. Big lead. I've thought about it, and I think yeah, I followed you before you did. But true, very true. Um, but I thought about joining the shoujo. Of course, after the applications closed, and I think it'd be great. I I think. It would definitely be an adjustment because the people of V Shoujo are incredibly talented, incredibly funny in their own unique ways. And I admire them a lot. I I just don't know if I'd quite fit in being like a being a little three foot five gob. Meanwhile you got all these beautiful beautiful anime characters being cool and and Puppy and funny. Not to put myself down. I, I think it's just a... I'm worried they'd find me a bit boring. But it's entire, this entire time Zen and Mel just been lurking in your streams. <laughs> what do I do? That I'm listening to my stream. Hi. Y'all agree? If I ever talk to Iron Master directly, I think my heart would actually explode. The loot cast the Project Melody? I think that'd be fun. I I don't exactly know what we'd talk about, but I think it'd be fun. Honey, you're cute and cheer is infectious. Am I not already biggest scob? Even if someone surpasses me, I think that's okay. Nothing's ever made to last forever. Just gotta have fun while you can, you know? Try to prep as much as you can for the future.
I love the Star Guardian playlist. It's so good. Sweet Anya, you're incredibly talented, honey. Funny, cool, and funny. Listen, this stream is just turning into y'all complimenting me, and I don't know if I can take it. Ventimo, thank you for the Risa. <laughs> Happy three months. Welcome back. Oh, pay tribute to the Gob Queen. Greetings from Mexico. Hey, greetings. Hope you're doing well over there. Hope the heat's not getting to you. I think it's hot this time over there. So, Shamit, thank you for the Now I'm imagining honey is facing a series of honeycomb. Slime. Honey, you were beautiful. Stop talking down about yourself. I, <laughs> thank you. I'm not trying to talk down about myself. Not at all. If anything, I'm I'm quite proud of my art and my skills and how far I've come. Um It's 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 kind of the equivalent of like going to the really cool popular kids table and going like, hey y'all are cool. I think you're really neat. I, I I don't know what your opinions are on me, but either way, you're doing great. And then I would just run away. <laughs> what if you're already cool? And I got nothing to worry about, do I? <laughs> Didn't Iron Mouse raid you? If not, uh, what would you do if she raided you? I got raided by Nianners and uh, Project Melody at one point. I was quite flattered. Uh, I didn't know Nyanners knew who I was, so... <laughs> Bit of an adjustment there. The Eldritch Queen herself. Oh, Truly. Truly, I was honored that day. I love Nyanners' content. No one, no one does cursed content like Nyanners. It's great. Yeah, you completely flipped my entire idea of goblins. Farthest thing from born. <laughs> Thank you! Also, Neko, thank you for the pasta. So excited for after vacation. I got a lot of things I'm gonna implement. It'll be good because I need to draw a lot of assets for it. So thank you for your patience, by the way. Also, Oni King, thanks for the hydrate. And Ulrich, thanks for the, oh gosh, for the hundred shinies. Wait, one sec. Imagining the group having a watch party stream. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. It'll be fine, it'll be fine, it'll be fine. Also, what was that? Thank you! Did someone say compliment? No! It's okay, it's okay. A straight, thank you! Would it be more manageable if we were mean to you? I don't think I'd like that. <laughs> also, jeez, Foxy, hi! How are you doing? Thank you for the 10 gifted subs! And Ulrich, thank you! Honey's cute goblin is very relevant to many people's lives, mine included. Watching your videos has helped me through a rough time. Thank you. I'm so glad. Oh my gosh. Honey's getting overwhelmed by kindness. I'm just getting overwhelmed in general. Hi. <laughs> How's it going, Steezum? Art time. Let's go. Also, sorry if you can't see the art really well. I a little dark. Yeah. Hmm. How's it going, Steve? How's Kajulu? <laughs> a little bit. But like in a fun way. Foxy's killing with kind. Go, oh, Foxy, no! Foxy, save your money. Foxy, you you take your time, save your money. Make sure you're providing for yourself first. Best muscle. What about aggressive positive? <laughs> you're amazing, you're gonna like <laughs> Chosen undead. No, that's actually one of the things that kinda I learned from uh inside out how toxic positivity can be really detrimental. And it was really fascinating uh thinking about it like that, because being sad is kind of a Part of life and it lets other people know that you are kind of in pain and that you need help really important you work my questions one sec a 
We already decided what the swimsuit would look like in advance. Are we winging it? I'm kind of winging it right now. Mostly I'm trying to get poses down first. Turn that off. <laughs> also trying to remember how to do gestures. Important to remember to do gesture practice every once in a while. Otherwise, you lose the skill, and you don't want that. Juice box. Foxy, thank you for the gift to Iron Mouse. <laughs> thank you. Oh, I love Iron Mouse's new model. Like, all of Iron Mouse's models are great, but, uh, oh, Twin did such a good job. It's so cool to look at. Also, Foxy, thank you for the resub. Welcome back. But I must support adorable cobble. Yeah, already supporting plenty. Thank you. Whoops on, thank you. Here's a question. Who is your favorite D&D &D deity? Mine is both Tyr and Bahamut. Hmm. So, <laughs> I don't actually know very many D&D, uh, &D, like classic D&D &D, uh, deities because my DM made his own pantheon. So I have favorites. Um from inside of his campaign, but less in the mainstream ones. Yeah, it's not only that, it's healthy to cry. Yeah, it's healthy to cry. Foxy, what mean? I only did 689 total. That's a lot. That's a lot. Also, death. No, are y'all just. <laughs> Thank you for the gift and sub to Silver Bay. <laughs> Sil Silver's busy. She's so busy. She's doing so much cool stuff. She didn't got time to worry about little old me. It's all good. It's all good. I will have the goal of a thousand. That's a far ahead goal, I would hope. He wants to so adorable. <laughs> I'm glad you like them. I'm planning on adding more. I've been in a bit, a bit of a... Um, had a bit of art block with them so far. They haven't been coming out quite the way I wanted, so I have been taking a break from them. All right, we're gonna do direction. Trying to do these faster so that I can get more art out. Greater velocity. Sometimes that takes a little bit of work. No! <laughs> Come on. Come on. Nah. Janowski, what have you done? What have y'all done? Thank you for the gifted sub to Shy Lily. And uh, and Janowski, thank you for the gifted sub to Snuffy. And thank you for the gifted sub to Zen, Ketmore. <sighs> I love Jojo. They're great. They're such chill people. They're so funny. Uh, I don't. I don't know how I feel about the idea of them noticing me. Someone. Someone posted under one of my Twitter posts. It's just like, did anyone tell you you sound a lot like Snuffy? And I was like, I don't think I sound anything like Snuffy. But maybe that's just me. Someone thought I sounded like Juniper for the longest time. They were like, is this Moth Mommy? And I was like. No, I think we have a very different cadence. I think we have a very different cadence. Also, I love Shiloh. Those just got a very pleasant voice. Foxy, thank you for the gifted sub to Draconis. Thank you. I do not actually know Draconis. <laughs> Foxy, I'm gonna go far left field. Ooh. Ah. Uh. Uh, think brain, think art, art on the brain, art on the brain, yeah, we focus, focus up. Nope, oh. there we go. There we go. Someone once told me I sound like Mordecai from the regular show. <laughs> JG Quintel? That you? Also, Kevmore, thank you for the gifted sub to Juniper. 
She's streaming right now. She's busy. Woody, who's your favorite VTuber? Hmm. That's a good question. I, I like a lot of different VTubers for a lot of different reasons. Foxy. Foxy, thank you for the 20 gifted subs. All right, all right, you... <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. You don't have to do that, Foxy. It's all good. Ooh. Who's your top five? Hmm. It's Rune, yes, yeah, swimsuit art. We're doing swimsuit art today. Let's see. Top? Uh... <laughs> Why is the Illuminati in your hair? Ever taken geometry? I'll just triangle. Yeah, my thing. The Daharga. Uh, so many cool VTubers. There's so many of them. Um, on brain focus. But we we can do this, brain. We can definitely focus. Favorite VTubers. That's what we were talking about. Neko, thank you for the gift of sub to <laughs> the Kason. <laughs> Kason, your model mom's a god. <laughs> I love Kason. Uh... This has just been ten minutes of me freaking out. Uh, I, I gotta, I gotta do, I gotta do other things. I gotta do art and think about my favorite VTubers before I forget, like a goldfish. The favorite. I do have a little bit of a bias. I will say this right now. Um, a lot of the times, whenever I look at a VTuber's channel, one of the first things I look at is their model because that's how they choose to represent themselves. So a lot of the times when I like a VTuber, I like their concept. Um, and that's like the first impression I get of them. Uh... So like the one of the first ones I really really liked. I really liked Art Gun's model of Snuffy. Very very good. The thing that um, made me the most impressed was the mouth tracking for it. And that's one of those times where I was like, oh okay, so you can you can do more with VTuber tech than just the standard stuff. All right, we're learning. We're learning. And so Snuffy's very influential in how she chose to present herself and how Art Gun. Um, made her model, and that's... <laughs> also, I remember the last stream I watched of Snuffies was just her being in, like, a video of a truck just singing country songs. I like that. I like that vibe. That's a good vibe. Probably not Juniper will rain, honey. Nah, Jun Juniper. Sorry, honey, my favorite. Oh. Foxy, I see that little peeking out emote. I see you. Ooh. Thank you for the eight gifted subs. And Warburn, thank you for the resub. Happy six months. Welcome back to the tavern. Let's wait until all the V show to notice the of I remember, like, I also love Zen because of the tech, not like, it sounds really nerdy, but like, I love the technical side of V. I absolutely love it. I love understanding how to make things move in real time. It's incredibly fun for me. And one of the things that really fascinates me is uh, I love how Zen's voice uh, works. And I'm very fascinated. I want to I want to learn how that works because people with more delicate voices, it would be so so helpful. You could, you could stream for so much longer and you wouldn't have to worry about straining your throat. It could be really, really helpful. Especially um, as well for like um, trans people, like if they have voice dysphoria, it very much help with that. It's, VTubing is great because it kind of, it's probably a, not a great way of putting it, but like levels the playing field in terms of content creators, it's cool. Honey talking to be Shoujo, me talking to Honey. <laughs> I, I had the opportunity to talk with uh, Mel and a couple other big streamers on Taka's show, and I felt kind of like a deer in the headlights, like, I have nothing 
funny to say, so maybe I should just be quiet for a little bit. I'll try to interject when I can. Um, <laughs> but it makes it, it's it can be difficult sometimes when you're in front of someone who you really admire and you, you're you're you might not be put on the spot, but you could feel like it, you know. Lauren, hey, thank you for the resub with Prime. Welcome back. Happy three months. And Death, thank you for the gift of sub to Konzetsu. Oh, that's the, uh, that's, that's Silverville's friend. Yes, the, the skeleton mask guy. I haven't seen too much of his content yet. Also, Foxy, yeah, think about your wallet. Think about your wallet. I just one thing, but hard to talk on voice with famous people. I think it's hard when you're in a group. If it's, well, yeah, if it's one-on-one, -on -one, it's a little easier because then there's a conversation you can start. Uh, but like, you don't always have to do that, of course. I just get nervous talking to people in general, whether they be VTubers or not. Foxy, thank you for the 17 gifted subs. Oh my God, Foxy. How do you see me in chat? Exactly. That's what it is. And Jam, thank you for the breathe routine. Okay. Peace. Yeah, my favorite VTuber is this really cool and cute VTuber is great at art and amazing singer, generally just an amazing person who has a positive impact on everyone. Comes into contact. Overall, I think Gobby's pretty great. I mean, guy, I'm right there with you. Gobby's pretty freaking awesome. I love her. Janowski. <laughs> Thank you for the 12 gifted subs. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. That's... Foxy! We're not getting into this. We're not getting into this. No. No! Uh, oh! Um... One one streamer who can def sorry I'm still on this topic. <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to get to, to get um distracted, but here we are. Yeah, I think one of there are very few viewers that can keep my attention for long periods of time, and that is totally fine. That is not a reflection of the VTubers themselves. It's more of a reflection on the fact that I am easily distracted, as you can probably tell from chat. Um. <laughs> Neko, no, don't tempt him like that. Um, what was I about to say? Yeah. Um, one of the few is like, I love watching the Dem Crew collabs because it just feels like a bunch of siblings getting together, razzing on each other, and having a good time. And I love Gary's stream, especially when he streams with many. There's. It's so cozy and funny, and Gary's just got such a positive attitude. Uh, and, ah, oh, Jummy's streams. I'm so fortunate that I know these people. Like, Jummy's, Jummy's actually super funny. Why, I, I don't know why I said it like that, but like, Jummy is incredibly funny. I was so nervous to meet her for the first time. And, because I thought she was so cool, and she she was so freaking nice, and I love how she talks, and just with the attitude she has, it was just, she put so much work into her streams, I love it so much. I'm so lucky. But yeah, and then like, Steez is fun to watch. He's... <laughs> Steez, Steez has got a nice casual energy for a lich, and I like it. It's real nice. Push this. Goes a little bit more. Also, sci-fi guy, thank you for the gifted sub. Wonder. Oh, I return once more. Welcome in. Take a seat and relax. Guy, okay, well, I haven't seen the Dem Crew also be in actual friends forever. Um, so it is basically siblings being punished. Yeah, it's uh, it's basically friends who have known each other for a long time and just. Bounce off each other and it's hilarious. Nuski, I maxed out on my Twitch allowance. I'm gonna make honey sad by going poor. For Good, Nuski, that makes me really happy. Very proud of you. Thank you for making sure to save enough money. Taking care of yourself is the first. So 
Okay, san is Silver's brother and also their mom's. <laughs> their mom streams with them too. She's mom. Oh, I know Mama Vale. You know, saying that I realize I should, I should gift her one, and then they can all watch you together as a family. <laughs> you don't have to, Janowski. Thank you for the three gifted subs, Foxy. Thank you for the five. Come on. I'm petty. Y'all better watch it. Y'all better watch it. But yeah, uh, Mama, I love Mama Vale's design too. I've considered bringing my mom on for streams, but at the same time, like I, I don't know how comfortable she'd be with that. <laughs> but that's okay. Sometimes you don't bring your mother to, you, and that's okay. I feel like my mom, <laughs> my mom would probably uh, not really know how to do it, like how to talk without giving like a topic. So I guess if I interviewed her. <laughs> yeah, thank you for the gift to mom. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Whoever ends first gift. Let him choose the next gift. Neko, no! Neko, no! It's okay, it's okay. Ooh. I need a drink. If your mom comes to stream, how would she look like? I'd probably draw her as a goblin, with, but with her haircut. She's got like... Yeah, she got short hair right now. It looks really good on her. I gotta drink some water. Things are heating up. Foxy, thank you for the gifted subs. Y'all... No more competing. <laughs> That's a lot. Maybe you can do that thing I've seen some Genshin YouTubers do, where you show your mom a bunch of characters and see what she thinks of them. Oh, true! Like a... Not quite like a ranking... I guess it would be kind of like a ranking stream, actually. A few moments later. Remember, honey, deep breathing. I breathe! I forget to breathe most of the times. I think one of my favorite VTubers, like whenever I see their tweets I get super excited, is probably... Uh, Art Gun. So I love seeing the innovative stuff Art Gun does. The fun art. In a lot of ways, I look up to Art Gun. I think they're super cool. They work so hard and they they learn such cool ways to improve VTubing for everybody. Like, they don't gatekeep their techniques. Well, to a certain extent. And, like, they don't gatekeep the technology. They've made it available and partnered with VTube Studio to make it more accessible. That's awesome! I want to hear the stories about Honey being embarrassed while all the family finds out about her <laughs> choice. No, Mama cannot see those. The topic of VTuber makes me happy to see disgust. Trying to get into it myself and stream being another goblin myself as well. It can be quite a struggle at the beginning. Yeah, new normal. It can be a little difficult, um, especially depending on how much art experience you have and what kind of VTuber you're going for. It also depends on, like, budget and whether you already know that you're going to be streaming or not. Because sometimes it doesn't work out for everybody. The PNG tubing is a really good... I, I say it a lot, but PNG tubing. Very good. Yeah, no. No need to... It's okay. Whoa. Yeah, that's why I'm telling you this. Yeah, those are the thick thighs. Are they? I just thought it was foreshortening. Is it, are these thick thighs? Well, Arkon, you like more for the rigging than the tubing. Arkon is a good for face rigging. Yeah, Arkon's good for face rigging. Big Perhaps? Your goblins have a religion. There's a bunch of different ones. Like how humans have a whole bunch of different religions. Kinda... regional based. Call your mom in and have her rate fish movie. <laughs> Here, questions. If you made a new or different kind of VTuber character, I have a new character. Well, uh, 
I actually... The first model I was going to make wasn't going to be a goblin, to be honest. Uh, but I knew I wasn't going to be able to do it. So I had to limit myself. Cut back on my scope. It was going to be something that had a lot of effects and a lot of flowy animations. However, due to time... Due to time and my inexperience, I knew I couldn't pull it off. So I drew it, but I decided not to go through with it because it would have frustrated me too much. What advice would you give to someone who wants to be a PNG tuber? Darked it. For PNG tubing? Honestly, um... Experiment. Think about what you want to be or how you want to present yourself and look for an artist that you, that arts uh, that has an art style that you like and is within your budget and commission them to do just a flat PNG of you. Preferably like two versions, one with an open mouth and one with a closed mouth. That way you can give the illusion of talking. But yeah, it's it's hard to go wrong with PNG tubing. I'm trying to be an otter VTuber as well. I'm currently PNG. I feel like I have no idea what I'm even doing. That's fair, and it's, if you know that you like stream as Otter, or if you're like, hmm, I want to change it, that's the flexibility of PNG tubing. It allows you to try different things, um, and or different art styles, and you don't have to worry too much about big budget costs of a change in model. What advice would you give to someone who wants to be a PNG tuber? I think I just read that. My brain... My brain did a flip. <laughs> I'm gonna lie, if I ever become a VTuber, I was thinking of making a sort of knight character with a helmet that makes him sound like he's talking with a bucket on his head. <laughs> like a Solaire! <laughs> also... Hi, Chim. How are you doing? Lovely, lovely Chim. Thank you for the 15 months. Honey, have you heard of this new trend called, whoa, what have I arrived to? Uh, swimsuits. We doing swimsuits because it's hot. Also, Romaine, thank you for the sub. Welcome into the tavern. I hope you're doing good. All right, let's see. What kind of swimsuit? I like swimsuits with high hips. Quite nice. Something like this. Like a... Oh, let's stop. Like a sports stop? Besides that. I like sports swimsuit. Miracle, thank you for the hydrate. If you know it would make it less hot, AC. <sighs> I know, you're right. It's just hot. Also, it's warm out. It is indeed warm out. It's not as hot as before. It's the, the measures I took. Just like blackout curtains. Help a lot. Also, Impact, thanks for the posture check. <sighs> Excuse me. Plasticus, thank you for the resub. Happy three months. Thank you. <laughs> Subjective. Add bones to the swimsuit? Ooh. Why did my brain go like, yeah, add a titty bone? <laughs> titty bone. Oh, maybe, uh, instead of that. What if I had a little cut underneath? To allow for ventilation between, between the, the breasts. I actually saw a sports bra very similar to this, and I'm like, ooh. I kind of want it. Because som sometimes it gets a little sweaty in there, and you don't want to, like, lift up your bra to, to ventilate. Okay, sip drying yeah, just taking a little sip in a swimsuit. <laughs> the breastbone. Yes.
Actually, that could be interesting. The, the boom bone? T-bone. <laughs> what a popular swimming hole for God. Also do gobbles use flotation devices. Yeah, sometimes. If you want to relax, you can just grab a flotation device and just float. We're pretty buoyant, though. Like, if you get a lot of gobs on the coast, like, yeah, well, you're most likely gonna run into a gob that swims. Maybe if you go further inland, you're probably gonna run into some who don't swim very much, or just go to watering holes. And movement. Yes. Breastbone connected. The ribs. Hmm. The good... symbol. Maybe, like, ventilation on both sides. Actually, that would be a really strange tan line. <laughs> Just a circle under the under the wrists and then above. Would look a little funny. Forest Goblin Lord come back. I, I already knew how to serve. My parents took me out to the to the coast. And I went swimming once in the water. Salt water did not taste good. It tastes bad. It tastes pretty damn bad. And the floaties? Ooh! Not a bad idea. Direction. And box thing. Your ears float. I mean, about as much as my head floats. So not very much. It's car I guess cartilage floats a little bit. Dump goblins think like rocks. That's because they don't empty their pockets before they go swimming. Just give it to your friend. Go to the beach in pairs and give it to your friend. That hand does not have the correct perspective. A bit closer. It's here. I'm sad to say this, but I'm heading off now. Goodbye, have a good rest of your day. No worries, thank you for dropping by. I hope you have a good rest of your day. Sometimes you just find really nice ones and you want to keep them in your swimsuit. <laughs> Not the best idea, but... <laughs> There's a public pool right next to where I live. One yeah, go for it if you have one. Go for it. Early, thank you for the piece. Happy to. Me. Platicus. Be opposed to a swimsuit fan art in the custom MT. At least three goblin decks. See why not? Magic the Gathering cards. Yeah, some shit like that should be fine. What color are you planning on using? Not sure. Maybe like a yellow or a nice summery colors. Brought coffee and cookies. Oh. That's unfortunate. Cookies sound good though. Nope, I just had ice cream. No cookies. 
right. Here's a question. I brought this up with Cove. Like, I was wondering what you thought about it. Do y'all like seeing one piece of art get worked on until it's finished? Or would you rather see, like, more art done quicker? Because honestly, I feel a little bit self-conscious about how art takes me a little while sometimes. So, a lot of the times I rush to finish art. Thus resulting in me kind of working on it off stream to correct it and everything. But I wonder if y'all like seeing the, the whole process, however long and drawn out it might be. I find saltwater creatures tastier than freshwater. I think so. Does your hair as you tell me to look to your left? Does it? trying to find the point because then I can uh, I can correct it in my model for the next pass anyways purple would look nice and true purple is, does really go really good hey cold on I've been doing good whatever makes you feel comfortable you should bring an empty chest along with a cooler to the beach that's a good I like it till it's done, that way I can enjoy and learn from every part of the experience. One piece done to complete. Okay. I like that you take your time, means more time to spend with you and everyone else in stream. Okay. I really like the whole process. Alright. I honestly didn't know that. Maybe, maybe it's just because like I like seeing the fast and speedy, like I love the time lapses because then I can get the information in my brain faster and faster. But I guess it's different for everybody. Huge advice you've been in here before. What do you mean, OMG Goblin? I think it's better to finish one completely before starting it up. Alright. Oh. Pretty much I'll be done. <laughs> It'll surely bring me luck in future map. Good luck. Art speed run for 70%. Different for everybody, yeah. Clean, rough bit. I wonder if I should put a second person in the drawing. Well, should I put in a swimsuit? Go. Hi, I'm gonna go get dinner. Love y'all, here's a kiss for all you homies. Thank you for the kiss, homie, I appreciate it. I feel a mix is good, and some of the quick sketches can become thick. That's true, Daddy. Sometimes I do like that. How frizzy would your hair be if you a lightning bolt? Pretty frizzy. Uh, it's already pretty frizzy, but... Uh, it does get worse with static. Plus, when you watch all of it, you can steal away more technique. Good point. Steal more technique. Snack. Jum hunting summer milfs. We could have jum hunting milfs. Watch the movie Prey on Hulu. It was good. Oh, okay. Good to know. Could do jum in a swimsuit. It would be a tasteful swimsuit. I don't want to make jum uncomfy. Uh, where should I put? I'll put him over here. Wait, he's got to wear shorts. I forgot. Have him sit with his little piggy legs like this, little shorts on. Melody? Is it presumptuous of me to put myself in art with... 
with VTubers I'm not like super close to? That'd be presumptuous of me. Like black and white British. Yeah, like the Minifori, the right word for it. How about snacking a little striped one piece? <gasps> oh, he needs sunglasses. Absolutely. Absolutely to Plotkus. You're totally right. He needs big old shades. His body needs to be smaller. Maybe a little presumptuous? A little bit. It's just fan art the way, so nothing wrong. True. The main thing is, like, for some people, putting yourself uh, in fan art with other big VTubers implies a friendship, which is not bad at all, especially if you're close to them. But I don't want to, like, insert myself into their their social circle as if I was, like, a, like really, really close to them. Uh, so that, that just might be a little bit rude, but I'm not sure. I think most VTubers would appreciate it more than anything else. Usually when I do fan art, I try to make it like solos, or if someone's part of a group, I'll, I'll try to do it with the friends of the group. Yeah. I'm trying to get in the opposite side. I don't want to step over any boundaries and make people uncomfy. That's not what I'm about. I don't like doing that. Yeah, that's that's a good proportion. Big head, small to have a healthy ego even if you call me presumptuous. All together in some parasocial anxiety. I, I do worry sometimes. I'm like, am I getting a little parasocial? Is this acceptable? Is, is this weird? Am I being weird? Because like to me, making people I admire uncomfortable or even just generally people uncomfortable, is much worse to me than potentially never interacting with them. I get it. As an artist, that's pretty true. Okay. Right. What happened to the sound alert sound? Hmm, is it broken again? Open up sound alerts real quick. Oh, you can draw honey. Surely honey would be... Yeah, honey next to honey? It'd be fine. Do a collab with Lost Paws and then I'll... You know. I don't know if that's how it works. Try this again. Okay, I didn't hear that one. I think I gotta turn up. Hmm. Who'd want to be close? Got him. Uh. <laughs> e. Okay, so that sound works. Maybe this. Maybe it's just such a low sound. I heard that. Hi, Dad. Or Town Hardy. How's it going? Do a goblin pool party with all your friends. True, yeah. Yeah, honey can pre record herself and have a fake conversation. Yeah, there you go. I could just have a conversation with myself. It'd be fine. Not lonely. Uh. Edit this one. Oh, <laughs> Hmm. Alright, I'm gonna play test and alert. <laughs> Why is that the one? Why is that the one? Okay, so I know it's working, but it's just that one. What if I just...
Pause the magical girl music. I have to test something. This has been bothering me for months now. Hmm. Okay, because I'm not hearing that one. Okay, I guess I'll just uh, remove it for now. Oh yeah, thank you! Oh, here's a little gopped. Rar XD. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Uh, also, Voxel, thank you for the... Check this out. There we go. I'm going to remove that one for now. Hopefully that fixes it. I'm so sorry about that. Yeah, hopefully that's it. Okay, sick. Next. Music back. All right. And Blood Asp, thank you for the breather, Dean. Do a little rough. Back. Get to the. The wound. Deep wound has been removed. It not breaking, or not working. If only had some sort of program to virtually manage the volumes of all your programs where they get routed to something like meter the volume if you would. Yeah, but volume meter kept messing up my uh, stuff and it was just too much. Oh no, backgrounds. Oh no. Backgrounds. Whew. Also, portal driver, thank you so much. Gob text time. Chat time. <laughs> Get your gob text. Get out your gold and toss it. It's okay, we already did that. We already did that, it's fine. Most of the Vishojo girls know of you in your art. I'm kind of surprised, yeah. I didn't know this. What a... What a weird experience, you know? Have people who are well known in this industry aware of your existence. Hard to draw. Bro, you don't have to pay a tax, it's all good. It was just a little joke, it's just a little goof. Also, Bandit, thank you for the least of the time. Happy three months. Oh gosh. Ulrich and Leaps Peak, thank you so much. Gob tech. Cute gob tech. Keeps going. Sci-fi guy, thank you for the gifted sub to steak sauce. Janowski, guys, you know that Gobbo is a precious beat. Genuinely awesome and lovable, but it's important to remember that these famous VTubers do not know that as well. We do, and part of being famous is clout chasing, which is always really uncomfortable to experience that and hard to undo once you get someone in. Even when it comes to inserting yourself in fan art. Go. Man, dude, thank you so much. Yeah, I, uh... <laughs> The thing with VTubers is a lot of the times friend groups are sometimes already set in that like, I, uh, I think John brought it up, but it's like, we have monkey brain. We can only remember something like 100-ish people at a time because that's how monkey brain works. And so we can only have so many close friends because that's how much emotional room we have for them. And I don't want to go around forcing my way into someone else's uh, pre-established friend group because that feels a little bit selfish to me. 
I I don't ever want to make someone feel bad or feel like they have to include me. Favorite animal and why? Hmm. Changes every once in a while. I like boars. They're fun. They're just cute. And Kitaro Kos, thank you for the resub. Happy four months. Welcome back. You don't do like corn on the cob? I do. It's delicious. Now he doesn't have monkey brain. What do you mean? What do you mean? No monkey brain? Just gremlin brain. Let's try doing a rough clean. Everyone first, <laughs> at least 300 goblins. Well, you might actually be able to fit all of them into your pocket then. Because there's at least 300 of us, I swear. So many. Nice really helped me out. I found some tutorials that are exactly what I was looking for. Thanks so much. No worries. I'm glad you can find some tutorials that could help. Stretch a bit. Well, last thanks for the breathe. I think I missed that, but I'm gonna do it now. Corn products in general? Yeah, corn's great. Reminds me of a uh, summertime. Ever I Corn's too. Friendships have to be 100% authentic and need all the correct protocols, especially in a business set. Something as simple as doing friendly things out of order can fill the hole. Yeah, it's. It sounds weird to say this, but it's almost like a little bit of a song and a dance, and sometimes it just doesn't work out. Sometimes your vibes just don't match. And that's okay. And also, some people sometimes grow out of friendship. And I don't think there's anything wrong with that. People are constantly changing and growing. It doesn't mean that you dislike a person because you hang out with them less. It just means sometimes you're busy. Or sometimes they become more interested in other things that you're not. That's just life. Part of being a person and growing. Also, oh, Leon thinks for the hydrate. Yes, water. Uh, excuse me. Kind of goes the same way for, um, for audiences. Everything changes sometimes, and that's okay. People grow, and change their tastes and preferences. Lauren, yeah, I had to take out the blepardine because uh, this model doesn't have a tongue. Note. That's okay. Next model, though. I've since learned. Have you tried rotating your canvas while drawing? I've always found it difficult to draw on a static canvas. It does help, sometimes just rotating it, because your arm naturally does different curves. And so it helps. But I don't do it too often. Ameta, thank you for the posture check. Excuse me. I go monkey brain? I thought I'll be to restore a single brain cell and had to wait their turn. Gotta be patient. Someone's gonna pass that brain cell at some point. Sunglasses on the head seem like it would fit. Ooh. Good call. I'll put sunglasses I think. Winter fans from up. I think my favorite season probably fall. I really like summer nights. Because then it's like warm enough so that you can just walk outside without any heavy jackets. But fall has Halloween. Harvest. Ugh. Oh, good memories.
Voxel, thank you. Uh, thank you to for converting to Prime Sub. Thank you so much. Sorry, I, I don't know why I struggled to read that. My brain's thinking about art now. Acquired. You good art? Bye. I rotate my canvas almost constantly. I have it bound to shift space, and then I move my pen and it rotates. I'm like, oh, that's pretty cool, actually. I still have to set some hotkeys. Like, as much as I love Clip Studio, I still haven't learned all the secrets to it. I always have more to learn. I spent hours looking at tutorials and references to my drawings. I think it'll be a good one. I'm sure to have fun doing it. That's the important thing. Having fun doing it. Also, Sausage VT. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. Two months. Welcome back. Hope you're doing well. And Florian. Happy 10 months. And insurance paid for another month. 10 months. It's expensive. I know it's steep. I'll just protect those leg bones. We get fall, but we don't see famous fall leaves. <laughs> famous fall leaves, not. Oh, yeah. Ah. This depends on where you go. I like seeing all the trees turn orangey. Pretty. Sausage! I'm glad you like my art stream. Thank you! Look at that feature. trying to unlearn drawing on 50 different layers for one piece or for one character because live 2d has trained me By default clip studio rotate this R and pen movement. Thanks. Yeah, you're right. Oops. A little bit. Probably for now. We're only 30 layers. Oh, that'll be rough. I'm already at like seven layers, and this is still the rough. Corbus. I mean, there certainly are celebrity tiers, but everybody starts somewhere, you know? Yeah, everybody starts at a different point. As we jump, we jest, but Twitch streaming, even just VTubing in and of itself, is a multi-million dollar industry. It might be goofs and gobs, but they te are technically celebrities on functions slightly different. Just function on slightly different rules. It's a really weird thing to realize as someone with ASD, but it's one of those things. It's strange being a very, very niche micro celebrity. <laughs> Literally, that party meme where like they don't know I'm a niche micro sitting in the corner of a party. <laughs> yeah, of course, but even the smallest steps of reasonability and influence comes with life adjustment. I learned that in Boy Scouts, being influential even to just 20 other people comes with substantial changes to how one functions in group. Especially when it comes to rules and appropriate conduct. Yeah, I've definitely had that kind of thought where I'm like, <laughs> oh no, I have a little bit of an audience. I, I gotta make sure that I that I am responsible with my platform. I gotta make sure that I'm not, you know, being mean and saying it's okay to be mean. Like that sort of stuff. Very interesting feeling. Not necessarily bad, but it's a, it's a bit of an adjustment. I'm sure people who have bigger audiences have it way more difficult than I do, though, so. 
Interesting, most interesting. I will watch your career with great interest. Thank you. Trying to get into drawing more while pursuing VTubing. Currently PNG, uh, but your stream and tutorial inspired me to draw a live 2D model. Slowly working on finishing the program. Understandable. It looks kind of intimidating, but like the little tutorials that pop up every time you launch live 2D can actually be very, very helpful. Cool, so you can always flatten some of the roughs when, and move into later stages. Yeah, that's true. Leon, I love I love the game grumps. Do you know who I am? Fit, it's so I really like the game grumps. I would be lying if I said I was not influenced by them. Wasn't influenced to get into content creation by them, but like a lot of my positive association with games comes from them. I used to watch their stuff back when I didn't have any video games to play. It was fun. Do a sketch of you and my other Mrs. Bond. So far, I'm liking it. Nice. Changing up styles is really hard sometimes. But it is good to learn. I'll probably do that as an exercise at some point. Try drawing in someone else's style as a style exercise. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. how micro nah. just for me like I I find that sometimes talking about it can be a little bit dry. it's like it's already something that you kind of got to pay attention to IRL so take a break from it with art and video games you know or some people may disagree and that's fine for me personally I like to keep it fairly light Was honey grump or not so grump? <laughs> Out of here. Uh, I'm not so grump, I would think. I feel like you would probably you'd be able to tell if I was a little more grump. What's that on grilled cheese? I love me some grilled cheese. Oh, oh, grilled cheese sounds so good. Oh, maybe I'll make some and then watch Buzz Lightyear. Sounds like a good night. Light. Eek. There we go. Super helpful to have one of the pre-made demo models in Live HD while working on your model. Yeah, senpai is shorty. It's very, very helpful to see how other people do the work. So that you can kind of get a good example of how you want to do it. For something with the hair loose flute? Yes. But what if this is before I jump in the water? That bun is way too high, actually. Probably should not be showing. Grilled cheese with some soup. Oh. Uh, okay, I went shopping yesterday and my mom went, hey, do you want anything from Costco? And I was like, yeah, sure. If you can grab me like a couple raviolis and maybe like uh, some cheese because it's cheaper at Costco. And my mom shows up at my place with a full trunk full of food. This is like, it's like eggs and a, a vegetables and eggs and i'm like mom i didn't ask for all these i love it and my fridge is absolutely chock full of food now thank you but also i just wanted a little bit of ravioli for lunch i love my mom a full fridge is something that i don't think i will ever complain about <laughs> <laughs> 
I just thought it was funny. It's a good problem to have. Hey, Lucy Faith, what's up? Very nearly forgot. I also got around to having Katsu at a restaurant. <gasps> mm. See how not grum honey is tomorrow during Path of Pain. True. Tomorrow I'm gonna get. I'm probably gonna get very, very angry tomorrow. Uh, because Path of Pain is painful. But it'll be fun. I'm gonna see how long it takes for me to get uh, get grumpy. Hey, I'm grump. I'm not so grump. And we're the game grumps. Anna, my daughter loves drawing anime stuff. She wants an XP Pen 16 tablet. Worth $700 or should look, look elsewhere? Ooh. Hmm. He loves drawing anime stuff. XP $700. That does depend on like how much you're willing to invest. Um, because I, I am definitely biased. I love drawing. I absolutely love drawing, and if I was a teenager, I would have loved to have a digital drawing tool. And for me, it would have been it would have been great. Until then, I just arrived on sketchbooks. Until quite recently, actually, five years maybe. Has it been? Pandemic has messed up my time. But if you're looking for a fairly cheap tablet, um, seven hundred is not actually too bad. But, uh, here, your daughter's XP pen was 4,300. Oh, that's a lot of money. Oh, 300. <laughs> I was like, you paid four grand for that? <laughs> Cove's brand new one from Wacom was like three grand. And that thing is fancy. Um, yeah, it depends on how invested your, your daughter is in it. Because if she really, really into it and she knows she wants to get into drawing, or she just wants to make- Or if she just wants to make the jump to- Oh, gosh. Hi, Juniper. How are you doing? <laughs> Off the moth goop. Also- Juniper, by the way, I love your hoodie. It looks really good. It looks very, very nice. How are you doing? <laughs> There's so many of you! Ah. Uh, thank you for the raid, Juniper. I hope you're doing well. Last I checked, it was it was just vibing, having a good time over in your stream before I did my own stream. <laughs> Off the moth goop. Do I want context for that? Thank you, guy. That is actually a good idea. Welcome, mothlings. Pleasure to meet all y'all. My name's Honey. I'm just a goblin doing some art. We're drawing swimsuits today. Look at this. It's cute. It's pretty cute. But I hope you're doing well. Yeah, you're just chatting. It was really nice. I don't need context. Oh, I don't want the context. There's a difference. All right. All right. We got you for crunk. Did you have a good stream, <laughs> Yeah, I got a model for my hand, too. Yellies, thank you for the resub. Happy 15 months. Welcome back to the tavern. Also, Spoon, thank you for the resub. Happy 14 months. Oh my gosh. Today, as always, the vibes are immaculate. No worries. Thank you for dropping by. That just spent $75 on a T20 dice. Nice. I hope it makes good clicky clacky sounds. Some of us got stuck on Juniper's channel. Only some of us came. Oh, dang. That's all right. That's not a bad place to be. In the lab with a moth monster. Good. Let's see. Welcome to the stream, honey. Is a good gob, our precious gob and best gob. <laughs> Appreciate it. I'm not an omnipotent. If I were. No, I'd still probably be beauty tubing. Beauty's hella drunk. That's. Uh... What was she drinking? Was it a cool one? Crack open a cold one with the boys down in the lab? Beauty got drunk as a skunk live in front of 2,000 people. Nice. Honestly, though, that does sound like a lot of fun. I considered doing- because I'm, I'm doing Hollow Knight tomorrow, and I'm doing the Path of Pain. I debated. I thought about it for like three seconds. I thought about taking a shot every time I died. However, <laughs> I feel like that's a good way to get alcohol poisoning, you know? Maybe not the best idea, but... 
Pokemon. But what if I don't get... Yeah, I just had to thought about it too much. Hollow Knight Pog, let's go. <laughs> Raz, you would die? I would think so. That was kind of my impression, too. Still pretty good. It's all good. It's all good. Model school? Thank you, Dagger. Dagger? Dagger. Why did I pronounce that with an I? I go drinking in the morning? I know. I could... Listen. <laughs> I could do a morning stream playing Path of Pain in Hollow Knight while getting smashed and mad. Now who's to say that doesn't make for a good fun time? Come on, come on. Not the best idea, but it is an idea. It is an idea. My fan just made a cracking noise, it's right above my bed. Da cheesy boy, I think you bet you have a chance to uh, save yourself there. That was your your fan's warning shot. Well, you shouldn't be dying. <laughs> dying, dying on Path of Pain. Yeah, probably not. So instead, I'm just gonna cry. It'll be fine. Get from a joint every death and overdose. <laughs> I feel like that's not a good idea. <laughs> I also like, I have never smoked. I, I can't because I don't think, I, I don't think inhaling smoke would really do very well in my throat. I would probably just cough it right back up. A strummer, I like you already. <gasps> Why, thank you. Also, Yellow Griffle, thank you for the coffee. <laughs> for a bad idea, drink every death or hit every... Ooh. What if I, what if I use the, uh, the honey charm? That way I don't actually die, I just... Regenerate constantly, right? That'll be good, right? All right, let's see. Let's get to the body. Oh yeah, I just felt like drawing a swimsuit today. It's hot. I wanted a swimsuit and I'm looking for one like this. I haven't found it yet. One day, one day I will. And I will get the funkiest looking tan line ever. I mean, like, do you do you see this? I will have a over boob and an under boob tan line. No amount of saying it's a swimsuit will ever be able to explain that away. Also, Stash Daddy, thank you for the gift and sub to the realism. <laughs> you can do a shot for death, make it a shot of water. True, that's actually a better idea. Ulrich, thank you for the song redeem. I'm getting too distracted. <laughs> Let me get the song up. Another raid? What? I got confused. The tavern have a smoking corner outside seating. It does have a smoking corner, but like it's 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 by the window. <laughs> Tan lines are pog. They're they're nice until you have to wear a strapless dress and there's just a weird circle on your chest. It doesn't quite work out that that great. I would. Uh, I guess that's what like foundation is for and like concealer is to hide that. I don't think it would be bad to have that kind of tan line, you know? Also, Pandark, thank you for the Pokemon Prime. Welcome in. Also, Haku... <laughs> Haku Yaga, thank you for the Risa. Hey, honey, guess what? You're really gorgeous, adorable, and sing really well. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. Thank you so much. All right, let me, let me turn down this music real quick. I got a song ready. Let's go back to the basic background for now. I'm gonna sing a Billie Eilish song, cause why not? Sing us a song, oh cute gob. I will, but not because he's he all rich requested it. Screaming outside. <laughs> That's not the right song. That's the other one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. 
I had a dream. I got everything I wanted. Not what you'd think. And if I'm being honest, it might have been a nightmare to anyone who might care. Thought I could fly. So I stepped off the fold and, hmm, nobody cried. Nobody even noticed I saw them standing right there. Kind of thought they might get. I had a dream, I got everything I wanted, but when I wake up I see you with me, and you say, as long as I'm here, no one can hurt you, no one will lie here, but you can learn to. If I could change the way that you see yourself, you wouldn't wonder why you're here. They don't deserve you. I tried to scream, but my head was underwater. They called me weak. Like I'm not just somebody's daughter, could have been a nightmare. But it felt like they were right there. And it feels like yesterday was a year ago. But I don't want to let anybody know. Cause everybody wants something from me now. And I don't want to let them down. I had a dream. I got everything I wanted, but when I wake up, I see you with me. And you say, as long as I'm here, no one can hurt you. No one will lie here, but you can learn to. If I could change the way that you see yourself, you wouldn't wonder why you're here. They don't deserve you. If I knew it all then, would I do it again? Would I do it again? If they knew what they said would go straight to my head, what would they say instead? If I knew it all then, would I do it again? Would I do it again? If they knew what they said would go straight to my head, what would they say instead? All right, let's get let's get the 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 Star Guardian playlist back on. <laughs> thank you, Ulrich, by the way, for that redeem. Also, Philly, thank you for the hundred shinies. All right, watch your ears. sleeves on. Not hot anymore. It's cooled down. Oh, Blood Ass, thanks for the hydrate. Also, yeah, Raiders, thank you for hanging around for the song. I really appreciate it. Whew. All right. Also, when I called Juniper's raid, you did, Jedi. I was about to say as soon as Juniper raided in, I was like, who called it? Someone called it. I was like, nah, Jennifer's not gonna raid in. She's too cool. She's a self-made moth lady, and we'd love to see it, but also, like... I'd... I really love to see her work. She's so good. Her art's amazing. I love it. Also, Bestial, thank you for the resub. Happy nine months. Congratulations. It's a stream, baby. Thank you, Albert. Also, Gecko, thank you for adding the Discord command. Alright, let's get to draw on the body. Never played an instrument before. I actually used to play the violin. I was not great at it. Uh, 
I couldn't read sheet music. Instead, what I did was I listened to what my classmates were playing, and I copied the notes that way. So I had to have someone play the song before I needed to perform it, and then I would be able to perform it fine. It is a... It's a little difficult to learn how to read music. And I was definitely not at all terrified that during that song. Definitely not! Definitely not! I'm not constantly terrified. That's all good. I'm totally fine. What do you mean? Anxiousness. No. Anxious? I on stream? Why would that ever happen? <laughs> that's more impressive, actually. I don't know. I don't know if that's more impressive. I I felt really bad because I, I felt like, in terms of music, I was like illiterate compared to my classmates, which is a little unfortunate, um, but... Hey, for concerts, it worked out okay. Rebandit, new to the channel, and I think I'll stick around for the long run. Thank you. Welcome in. I'm glad you liked it. Or liked, <laughs> liked the vibes. <laughs> oh, yes. Pinero, thank you for the posture check. Oh, my arms need a stretch. Excuse me. And Ulrich, thank you for the breathe reading. I want to hear a duet with you and Iron Mouse. That would be awesome, but Iron Mouse could sing circles around me. I feel like she would be carrying my voice. And I give Juniper VIP if you can. I guess I could. Do I have? Ah, I spelled her name wrong. <laughs> so I'm playing by ear, hard skill to learn. I don't know. I I was about to say was it, but I'm like, you know what? I don't actually know enough about music, so maybe it is. I feel like learning to read and then put that those notes in your brain that make it go to your arm is harder. Well, is she still screaming on the inside? It's my secret. I'm always terrified. Always. Someone is rubbing up a motor out there. Don't forget to blink sometimes for hydrated your eyes and stretch too. Yep, I gotta blink. Because when you look at a screen for a long time, you gotta remember to blink. If I remember correctly, uh, looking at screens too long can dry out your eyes. Take a break. Look out the window. Or look at a piece of paper. Just for a little bit. Actually, while I was in art school, one of my classmates taught me that if you want to reset your eyes, get a book, read like a couple sentences far away, and then read them up close, and it's it's just exercising your eyes. Good enough. I'm sewing cosplay stuff right now. Your art my ideas. <gasps> I'm glad. I love seeing cosplay. Cosplay is so cool. I liked it. Thank you so much for the resub. Happy stream, baby. Congratulations. Been busy fighting COVID, just want to let you know how awesome you are. Stay classy. Thank you! I hope COVID's not being too mean to you. But yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm glad you're getting some rest. It's very important. Rosamond, don't mind me just casually waiting for the song reading to reset so I can ask you to sing happy birthday for me. <gasps> Rosamond! Right, the real Zumi. Demdi. Demdi. Happy birthday! I didn't know it was your birthday. Oh, it was a good one. Did you get to eat some cake? Gotta dry the under boob. Gotta be a little higher. There we go, that looks about right. Hi Josie, how's it going? How was the con? Is VIP the same as tier three? I don't know how those work. They're a bit different. VIP, I believe, has the ability to uh, skip slow mode, and as well as a couple other benefits. Playing by ear can be pretty hard to learn, but playing a fretless instrument like a violin makes it learn faster. It's rough. Ooh. 
both of you to assume I can reese. Re <laughs> read. I make my point in one sentence. How long till somebody tries to assassinate the CEO of Among Us? Like, the built-up resentment towards the memes is just too much for anybody. Stat. Snap. I don't know. As soon as it stops being funny, I guess, to streamers. One day I'll... Like, three years after the meme's dead, I'll just pull an Among Us on the dem crew. Just cause I could. Thank you for the resub. Happy 11 months. That's a pulchritudinous swimsuit. What's a pulchritudinous? What's that? What's that word mean? Dark ball in slow mode? Yeah, so whenever someone's chat is going really, really fast and they can't read anything, in the bottom, it'll there'll be a little thing on top of the chat box that says slow mode. And you can set it to either like 5 seconds, 10 seconds, 20, 30, a minute whatever you feel comfortable with. And it's just, it gives the streamer a bit of time to catch up with what chat's talking about. Everchill, how do you draw thighs? Uh, with some practice and reference. It's a little hard, especially if you have foreshortening. Foreshortening is really tough because it so these, these thighs are foreshortened. Actually, one trick that I'll show you real quick is if so your thighs can be, this is the pelvis, and these are the thighs. This is a front view. The knees would be here. If you want to an exercise in foreshortening, try drawing cylinders, or sorry, circles around the thighs to emphasize the foreshortening. So if I were to do it on here, here's the B. E. It would look something like this. So it can visually give you an idea of what foreshortening looks like. It also helps with how you can make fabric lay on top of the thighs, or if you want to make, um, if you want to put something on top of the, the thighs. It just generally helps to emphasize what direction the knees are pointing. Sounds too technical? That is fair. Oh, gratuitous just means really pretty. Oh, okay. Why, thank you. I, I am not, um, my vocabulary was not big enough to understand that word. I can give an example with a 60 second slow mode if you want. That is pretty, that's pretty long. So we are not slowed, your feed is to read it. Yes, so you are not slowed, uh, my feed is. I think it also, um, I think it also makes it so that people can't spam chat. So, yeah, the more you know. They're following small brain. Me too, small brain. Eh, small brains unite. I think Jummy's borrowing the brain cell for tomorrow. Juniper clearly handed off her brain cell to me. <laughs> After drinking. Oh, that sounds like fun. Does Twitch allow that? I remember at one point, like, Twitch was really being harsh with what streamers could and couldn't do. I can't remember if, like, drinking on stream was something that they couldn't do. I feel like that'd be really fun. That hang a little bit. Thin it a little bit. Community brain cells are on fire, send the fire department. They're burning up. It's just that SpongeBob meme of a bunch of SpongeBobs running around his brain. Sending like treasured memories into the paper shredder. Do one. There we go. Dark Ballin, thank you for the ear wiggles.
Drinking to excess and taking drinks for subs and donuts is not allowed. Gotcha. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. So if I were just to drink every time I die in a certain game, it would be acceptable. Not Path of Pain, but another game, perhaps. Ooh, what if I did a no-die run of Dark Souls? Not a hitless run, because that would be too hard. Way too hard. But like, I hope that'd be fun for Dark Souls stream. Or Sekiro. You would 100% play a drinking game with a bunch of goblins. <gasps> Ooh, that does sound like a lot of fun. Uh, let's go. I'm gonna avoid drawing feet for now because I feel like it. <laughs> or I don't feel like drawing feet. Red Stove Art Dark Souls. I love Dark Souls. It was the first video game I played. For context, for those of you who do not know, uh, I didn't play video games until fairly recently in my life. And one of the first one I ever played was Dark Souls. Yeah, can we still have that Asian fight to finish? Oh, oh, I do. Oh, don't worry. It's gonna be fun. I have been training. I gotta invite Sky onto my stream for that though. I lost a bet, so. Gotta follow up with that. I was hoping I'd get Sky's model done in time for that, so. We shall see how it goes. You know you're in trouble when you have two brain cells and when one of them yells clear and turns on the defibrillator. <laughs> No die run is technically possible, but would that include the mandatory deaths some of the games have? Hmm, I, I feel like if, if, if they're mandatory, then they don't count. You know? Dark Souls Master? Uh, I wouldn't say a master. <laughs> I am not the best there is. Why would you hurt yourself with a deathless run of Dark Souls? There are people who love you. Sometimes, I have to prove it to myself. It can technically be avoided, really? This is what I mean, I don't know everything about Dark Souls games. I just like them. Yeah. Currently getting ready to fight the final boss of Elden Ring. Two issues, why is the boss so hot and why are they so thick? I haven't finished playing Elden Ring. I, I got really burnt out on Elden Ring, actually. It was just so much of it and I was streaming it and I felt like because I wasn't progressing fast enough, I... I felt stressed whenever I started streaming it, so took a break. I wanted the true child gaming experience. <laughs> Your first game was a rage game, huh? Yeah, it was uh, Dark Souls One. I really liked it. It was, it was so much fun. X. I should probably go back and play it. Good one to play. That's one of the things I don't. I don't get too mad at video games, uh, especially Dark Souls. I do get mad at platformers, though. Uh, platforming is different. But Dark Souls is very, very fun. All the challenges just seem hard but fair. At least in my mind. Yeah, yeah my favorite video game is Sekiro. It's so good. It's just Feels so good after you beat a boss. Satisfying. Love the struggle of the game, the grind, the cultivation of skill, the testing of metal against metal. I've actually had this conversation with Cove, uh, my roommate, and she's just. <laughs> I tried to get her to play um, Dark Souls. No, I tried to get her to play Bloodborne. So we did a full playthrough of Bloodborne where she basically got to go through the entire thing fresh, and I had already played it, so it was fun. But I can see why- I can see how some people can get mad at that game. I just get so distracted by the visuals, and it's just like, oh, it's beautiful, I don't care that I died to this horrific monster, I just like seeing it move around and fighting it. It's fun. Soulsborne Saga is my calm down relaxing games. Yes! Amaya, you get it, you get it. Sometimes you gotta bring yourself to the limit, break them, and go beyond ultra, beyond forget those limits you had once you get good. And he's a masochist. A little bit. 
Just a little bit. I'm starting to realize. Ah, <sighs> Jump King and your- Oh gosh, yeah. I don't think I could do Jump King. Jump King takes a different kind of person. Absolutely just built different. Yeah, platformers are the ones that, that frustrate me. It's the... I think it's the lack of progression when you fall. That's the thing with uh, Dark Souls, is even if you die, you still feel like there's a sense of like, okay, there I failed in this area, but the map opened up and I can go in a different direction. So it's really cool. It kind of gives you a break from one area and the game says, okay, you're not good enough for this. So try this, you baby, and get good. And then you do. And the game says, good for you. Now do it again. Back Hero's best sword combat ever. It's really good, Death. It's so good. I just didn't know what other games were yet. She was smaller in night. That's true. I also didn't know what other games were. I... My parents never got me any consoles since I was a kid. I just wasn't... <laughs> we lived in a small house and I have a lot of siblings. And so in order to make sure that we didn't spend too much time inside, where there would be a lot of us, my parents signed me up for like three different sports per season. And it was fun. I stayed in a lot of shape. Or I stayed in good shape. But it meant I never played any video games. And so my experience was heavily skewed when I did enter the realm of video games. There we go. The Code Vein. A lot of people have suggested Code Vein to me. But isn't it like, oh no, near is the bullet hell. Still. Well, it's bedtime and then some. I think I'll get some sleep so I can do some prep work before I stream tomorrow. Try to lurk and maybe watch some of your stream in the AM. Take it easy. Thanks for dropping by. Covain is just weave dark soul. Covain is the... Which one is the one that's um, advertised like it's very similar to a Soulsborne, but it's also like a feudal Japan, but with demons? What do you draw? Swim suits. One of the worst rage inducing games I've ever seen is Getting Over It. Yeah. Getting Over It's pretty bad. Yeah, I consider that a platformer. Neo, that's the one. I was thinking Nier, but I'm like, Nier's not quite the same thing. I want Neo. the other half the moth raid <laughs> red bandit i started playing dark souls 3 when i was eight and it took me months to beat my first boss my defense i was really stupid it's a hard game i yeah i don't consider any game she doesn't like a platformer it's because i don't like platformers that's how that works right right i do love it it's so cute i miss doing swimsuit art I haven't really done much recently, but let's get back into it. Oh, I gotta do hand anatomy first one. Gotta break this down. Gotta look at my own hand and be like, how do you hold the juice box? Are we supposed to be that old now? Jeez. Time isn't a is is fake at this point. Like I I have no idea what year it is. But I'm just gonna go with it. There we go, okay. Sometimes worrying about time stresses you out a lot. And it sucks. But it's okay to take breaks from the calendar every while. Well, as long as you don't miss any important dates. And horror games. Yeah. My heart can't take horror games. I'm actually, uh,. <laughs> I'm actually planning on going to the doctor and seeing if my... Like, I have to do a tech checkup anyways, because, you know. You gotta do that, and I haven't gone to the doctor since I would. 
That's not good. But yeah, I just gotta make sure everything's in tip-top shape. Otherwise, I gotta make some life changes. That's what it's the, the appointment's for, right? I like the other hand better. I don't know that shape is nicer. Right. Take care of the god. Exactly. Got to take care of ourselves. Try any boomer shooters. I'm actually really bad at FPS. I don't know if that's exactly the same thing, but I'm very bad. Doesn't like platformers. Loved Hollow Knight. I know Crimson. It's a bit of a, it's a bit of a mystery, but Hollow Knight's probably one of the few exceptions. Sekiro's fallen ninja versus former former clan who betrayed him and their lord. Neo is Irish guy getting revenge on a Japanese guy and the Queen of England's right hand man. Neo 2 is your half oni that wants to kill your mother's killer. <laughs> That's not the not what I was expecting from Neo. Cosmic, thank you. I don't play Soulsborne games, but as someone who knows the sheer exhilaration of getting yourself handed to you by a physically superior opponent in a fight, and grins just as much on the losing end of the fight as the winning end, the spirit of a Soulsborne speaks to me on a spirit. Also, yes, Gecko, I know I still get scared by toaster sounds. I don't know where I am or how I got here, but hello. Hello there. Did you happen to be in uh, the lovely Juniper stream? <laughs> Did Juniper came for a visit and uh, was kind enough to drop by. In case y'all are just showing up now. Welcome. My name's Honey. I'm just a cop that likes doing art. And playing Soulsborne games. Come here, cute model. Thank you. I made it myself. I know the goal for the next subathon should be Honey goes to the doctor for a checkup. I would hope I would go sooner than that because my next subathon is not going to be for another eight months. It's going to be a bit. It's going to be a bit. Currently playing Elden Ring while watching this. Ooh, that's a good. That's a good thing to vibe to on Friday nights. Honestly, Elden Ring's real good. Elden Ring is really fun. The one thing that I get a little frustrated with for Elden Ring in particular, though, is just, um... How did I do that? There you go. I think I like being railroaded a bit in terms of, like, uh, the story. Like, Dark Souls' story has always been very vague, you know? But there has been a sense of direction. With Elden Ring, it's really open, and you can go in any direction. Which is good, and it's different, it's not bad. But I kind of like the, you're snaking your way through a maze that loops into itself, you know? Save money for the next eight months. We got some time, it's all good. Next goal is honey going to the dentist. My teeth are fine, my teeth are okay. I got good sharp teeth as a goblin should. Foxy, thank you for the gifted sub. And Guildford, thank you for the gifted sub. Oh gosh. I ever drawn a femnoi? What's that? Foxy. Thank you for the 10 gifted subs, Foxy. I'm sorry, I just bat, I just bat my own mic. Humble up, thank you for the hydrate. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry I banged my mic with my, my, my water bottle. <laughs> sorry. What's up, Shugalix? How's it going? I'm just drawing a hand. It's going pretty good. Foxy, chaotic. Chaotic fox you. Also, totally Falcon. Thank you for the 200 shinies. <gasps> for me. How oh, kind. Dark Bolt. Quality Chompers. They're great. Good for biting people. Don't bite people. <laughs> Unless they're into it. On uh, fingers. Let's go. Go by shape. Oh no. That finger's way too thin. 
Uh oh. Elden Ring did open world better than other open world games. I I actually like Breath of the Wild's open world a little bit more than Elden Ring. I do still love Elden Ring, but something about Breath of the Wild's way of doing it is very nice. For me. Maybe because it gives quests uh, or like a sense of direction with the dialogue a lot easier. But again, that's just me. You're not seeing. <laughs> Thank you for the thousand shinies. Oh my gosh. Foxy cannot be stopped. Truly a chat among men. We are all loyal followers of the King Kong. Has this become a cult now? Has this tavern become like a church? Why not someone beat Spooky's jump scare mansion in only 10 minutes and 22 seconds? Ow. Ow, because I would like to know. So I can beat it and never have to play it ever again. That would be... Great. Really found Breath of the Wild had a way less sense of progress doing anything. Hmm. That was just... Just for me personally. Might be different for every, other people. Not for everybody. Save. It's called I Got the Kool Aid. <laughs> now that's Cab's channel. That's this Cab's channel. The stack called to the gob called to the gob i don't think i'm a short stack i think i've had this conversation before but i'm not thick enough to be a short stack i can just short <laughs> not thick enough in the hips look at those that's 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 not super thick that's like comfy thick and a cult leader now i'd be a bad cult leader honestly i would be real bad at that I would show up late to my own meetings. I honestly had trouble playing Breath of the Wild, but ironically I can't get enough of Pokemon Legends Arceus. Hmm. Different games appeal to different people for different reasons. Church of Thideology. Tie me up. Thighs, thighs are comfy. Thighs are comfy. Hi Tia, how you doing? I play Call of the Lamb. I do really want to play Call of the Lamb. I don't think it's out yet, though. Is it? Short, not stacked. Tragedy. Haven't got the the squish required for a short stack. I got the height for the short. Three foot five, baby. Let's go. It's actually kind of tall for a goblin. Now that I think about it, that finger's too long. make me want to listen to Gary's synthesizer from regular show. All the is out? <gasps> Alright. I got Rickrolled in a YouTube ad. <laughs> got him! Can't believe you fell for it. Thought you were watching an ad? No, no, no. Couldn't be. Couldn't be. Also, Berka, thank you for the prime! That's very kind of you. Thank you. In this religion, we accept all gods, physical, mental, or metaphysical, or other. Everybody's a god. Everybody's a little gremlin. A juice box. Juice box. I spelled juice box wrong, but that's okay. A little bit. There we go. She got the juice. What is that? Oh, it's Janelle Monet. That's what it is. I like the visuals of Janelle Monet's music videos. Really cool. And colorful. about how big juice boxes are in my hand. Get more bang for your buck when you're small. Keep 
people ask, what's the best part of being so small? Everything technically cheaper, because if I just get a big sandwich, that's a whole meal for two people. There we go. Ew, why do you struggle drawing it so much, honey? Flappies. There we go. Talking about cults while drawing a Kool-Aid slurp might be a bit suspicious. Only a little bit. It's apple juice, not Kool-Aid. Juice. Got the cake. She do. A little bit. Just a little bit. Like. I don't know if this is cake. Or like a little cupcake. I feel like more of a kobold than a gremlin or a goblin. I feel like kobolds are kind of in the range of gremlins. Stretching my neck real quick. Huh. Fun size snacks are not so fun when you're... Not fun size. But they are snacks. I was just as lean. Blah. Blah, blah, blah. Uh, tastes like. I also didn't know that lean was a, <laughs> was a drug until like. Not even a drug, is it? Let me look it up. I'm curious. I heard it in uh, Old Town Road. Oh, it's codeine. That's why. A purple drink or sizz scissor. <laughs> Huh. Alright. Cool. Don't do hard drugs, kids. Lean is code and mix with purple drink. Yeah, I know very little about drugs. I was I was like one of the two people that the D.A.R.E. program actually worked on. <laughs> Teacher used to wheel in these big ass teeth that were honestly so much trouble. They barely fit through the doors. And they'd play the dare videos, and I'm just like, old. Oh, we have crisper looking shows now. And then my teacher was like, okay, and then showed us some very, very graphic stuff about mathematics. Like, cool, I am scared straight. Don't do this because it's bad. Yep, got the message. Drugs bad and gay. <laughs> Brains to print on drugs. This is your family, and it just starts smashing the kitchen up. I mean, that lady renovating. Just renovating her kitchen, as one does. Frying pan. They got TVs on VHS. Yeah, I think those ones. Those are the ones I'm talking about. Let's see. Well, oh, thank you for the resub. Welcome back. Good evening. Glad I caught a stream for once. Oh, welcome back. Happy 14 months. Look, I was that kid now, I'm gonna pot growing bacon. <laughs> nice. Locally sourced. The D.A.R.E. program worked on me too, I just didn't count for how awesome we was my D.A.R.E. <laughs> yeah, I, think, I think I mentioned before, but like I've never smoked because I don't think... I just don't like the idea of my throat being so dry and full of smoke. And as I'm sitting here, my edible kicks in. <laughs> When your kitchen is that much of a disaster in the commercial, you start remodeling with anything. Hey, whatever you got, I'll do my best. Yeah, I got the asthma, so I cannot do the smoke. That makes sense. No, that's I don't think. Yeah. You get me. Alright, let's see. I don't feel like drawing feet, so I'm gonna procrastinate that a little bit. Do that other hand. I feel like this hand's a little too big. Fingers are a little too pointy looking. Let's uh, edit that then. There we go. It. As much as I would like my fingers to look elegant, cool, they're a little bit... Not stubby, but they're not that pointy.
There we go. That looks a bit, a bit closer. Totally. <laughs> Head empty, no thoughts. Go to state. Gecko, I don't smoke because I see more problem coming from advantage. Absolutely fair. As much as research is like, yeah, speed is okay for you. It's like, do what you're comfortable with. Do, do what you feel is okay. And if you decide to try, go, go with a friend. Spirit, spirit. Hmm. Good question. Banshees. Mythologically, I just like them. Senpai. Sometimes a little procrastination goes for the effort. Yeah, exactly! Sometimes. Good to take a break from the thing you're drawing. Also, Evil Crash, thank you for the 200! Fun fact, goblins can't swim. What? Nah, we can swim. We can totally swim. Right next to the other man, the alcohol? Yeah, I know. I'm just messing around. Also, Mothman, thank you for the posture check. More stretches are good. Hmm. Excuse me. Changes color. As I feel like it. We're gonna make it blue. Ah! Uh, just kidding. That hurts my eyes. I am in a slightly dark room. Is this better? Maybe not. <laughs> Put it back. Put it back. Uh. There you go. Oh. Somehow this is better. <laughs> aye, aye. I think there's something called CBD pills, but I think they're just nerfed weed pills. <laughs> Adela, thank you for the hundred. Why are you on while I'm drunk, you damn cutie? Why are you drunk while I'm on? Actually, no, it's Friday night. That's fine. That's... <laughs> Friday is a very common time to drink. I think it's when she could not be available for being partner in Exactly! Even as a kid, I understood. I needed to learn how to swim to find a mermaid partner. A mermaid. I need to redo that hand and have me real quick. Perspective. part of weed that makes people chill. It's basically just an antipsychotic. <laughs> I don't know enough about it. Also, it's a tavern. Very true. This is a good place to be to just have a drink and chill out. Okay. Curious to know, when it comes to drawing, the size of the canvas and the size of the brush. Do you recommend a certain size and brush size so nothing comes out too small or big? I personally like working in... Uh, 4,000 by 4,000 with 600 uh, DPI, uh, in case I want an HD, but 300 DPI is plenty, so that is more than enough. And brush size, anywhere between 8 to 15 is good. Depends on how detailed you want your work to be. I'll probably make this bigger, honestly, because it's, as it is, it looks a little bit too thin, but it should look a bit better when I color it. Have you seen Stranger Things? I've just seen season 1 and 2. Season 2 was... Fine, I just wasn't really interested in it. The storyline didn't capture me. First season was really good, though. My dad went to New York and got me special chocolate. He said one square was 25 milligrams or micro. But he meant the whole thing was 25. The chocolate melted and I couldn't see the... It's in the chocolate. I ate the half the whole thing. I was on the ground crawling asking for... <laughs> Uh, that's unfortunate. Hey, Poppy, what's up? Come in. First of all, you do not stay for work. Not on Twitch, um, because that would go against terms of service. Or, US. 
I do have a clause in my uh, terms of service for my commissions. Like, I can do not safe for works. Uh, but, like, client would have to specifically request it. There are some rules with it. Like, nothing violent or anything, like, graphic. Or... I don't, I don't do particularly well with gore. That's not my area of expertise when it comes to art. But yeah. Goblin versus forklift. Who would win? Genuine question. I feel like the forklift. If there were enough goblins, maybe. Maybe it would work. Yeah. You'll see, unless she's working in a suit. Is that <laughs> then a sativa would be in order? Turns your artistic creativity up by ten thousand percent. I actually I looked this up because like a couple days ago I had a problem with my focus. I was really able to get a lot of artistic energy out at night, and I didn't like that because I have to maintain a sleep schedule in order to work. So I looked it up, and apparently if you drink like just the perfect amount of alcohol. If you can get the same effect during the day. I didn't want to test this because I don't want to make it a habit. But it does explain why a lot of artists were drinkers. Bad badge. Well, if it is my all-time favorite goblin, why feel like? <laughs> How's everything been? Those dice can save my draconic life anytime. Thank you. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Percival, do you do not say for work? Sorry, I meant for me doing commission. Yes. Asterisk. Uh, but not say for work myself? I'd prefer not. Because uh, just because I like I don't want anyone to like see the art and then go like, oh, this is the kind of streamer they are. It's like, no no no, no like we vibe, we chill. No, not say for work here. Perfect amount, half a gallon it is. I feel like that's a lot. That seems like a lot. Oop. There we go. That hand needs to be a bit bigger. That looks about right. Actually, turn. Fair enough? Okay. This is different for everybody. Thank you for asking. I was there, no food left at the Halloween party. Everyone was a goth. <laughs> uh, I love Halloween parties. I'm super excited for it this year. I don't know if there's gonna be a party, but I just like dressing up. Okay, responsible weed usage is good, pretty good for artists. I had to quit because I was definitely not being responsible, but small doses are good to get that creativity and mind expansion. Good to know. I, I don't know enough about what the difference between THC and CBD is, so I would have to do some research. And find a day where I'm free to actually try something. <laughs> See what the hype is like. Safe, responsible environment. Because it's really, it's really interesting how nowadays people kind of treat it almost like drinking. Like, there are stores that openly sell them, and like, they all have fancy names now, and I'm just like, okay, this is a shift. Wasn't really expecting this, but then again, it's it seems like it has some uses. Night, Fire Newt. Harvey, why are you up so late? It's only 9 for me. I'll probably be up for another 20, 30 minutes, maybe? We'll see, I got a good art grove going on. These fingers are looking good. Now nah, I'm second guessing my fingers. <laughs> EB chills you out and you to treat anxiety. THC gets you high. Oh, okay. Wonder if CBD would actually help me with stream anxiety then. <laughs> Might be something to think about. Because every time before stream, I get very, very anxious about stream. A, uh, trying to get over that fear. Hey, Mr. Cake! I'm doing good! How are you doing? CBD gummies do exist? 
That is true. I wouldn't have to smoke anything, so that would be better for my lungs. Gecko, it's midnight here. You can get some sleep, Gecko. <laughs> get some sleep, Gecko. Also, Syriac! Or, Cyric. <laughs> Thank you for the resub. Happy seven months! It was my birthday today, and I want to take this opportunity to let you know I love your art. Your voice reminds me of Eileen from Regular Show. Huh. That's kind of cute. I like Eileen. But thank you, and happy birthday. I hope you had a good one. Mad Magi. Meant to say 11 p.m. That's still pretty late. Let's see. I forgot to draw a nose. Probably be around here. Put it there for now. I'll think about it a bit. Okay, do not self-medicate. We should only do fun. That was my trap and five years of addiction later I regret not being able to be more self-aware of my usage. Yeah. That is the main thing is like I don't want to start anything that might be addictive. That's one of those I'll have to check it out responsibly. Smoking us. Come on. Have you? Are the cute goblin girl I've been seeing around? Hey, welcome in. Hope you're having a good night. Here, thanks, honey. It was good enough. That is good then. Sometimes you just need a good day. Could not be perfect. Yeah, that looks better. Still think one hand is bigger than the other. Fix that real quick. And these caramel apple gummies are awesome. Oh, caramel apple sounds really, really good. Dang. Ooh, let's put sunglasses. Sunglasses are hard to draw sometimes. Move it a little bit. Lazy River. Is that a band? I do like Lazy Rivers. Here, any drawing tutorials you recommend for beginners? Hmm. It depends on what you want to start drawing. Do you want to start drawing like backgrounds or characters? Do you want to start drawing, um, do you want to get into character design or more into anatomy? It depends on what you're looking for. Because usually the best option is to look up on YouTube and go tutorial for drawing eyes and then look through the thumbnails and see what style of eyes you like the most and then from there you can look at the tutorials youtube is a real good place for that one thing that can help with social anxiety in particular is the hormone oxytocin which is involved a lot in strong emotional bonds you can increase it via things like hugs oh. I'll have to go out to my homies and ask for hugs. See if that helps with the anxiety. <laughs> Let's actually tilt this a little bit more. There we go, that's looking about right. No goggle for goggle. 
Nah, this is a casual beach hangout. Not too much for me. Gotta protect those eyes, though. That's pretty good. I think I need to lower that arm a bit. There we go, a little bit lower, yeah. There we go, that helps a bit. I'm right, just starting drawing basically anything including shapes and patterns is a good way to start getting paid. Yeah, like I, what I did for a really, really long time back in high school was I just drew eyes constantly. There were different style of eyes, they were like anime, cartoon whatever felt comfortable and I could just draw that constantly and that got me familiar enough with shapes and expressiveness because a lot of expression for a piece with a character in it is in the eyes. A lot of the times if the eyes look correct you can get away with a lot of other stuff in your art. Really I have no homies? Oh. What do you call us? We're not homies? I gotta protect them big old peepers. They're big eyes. I gotta make sure they don't get blinded. Otherwise I can't do art. Are goggle eyes sensitive to bright light? I think everyone's are. Not that sensitive though. <gasps> Ivy, how you doing? No hugs? What if I want hugs though, V? What if I want hugs? Also, thank you for the hydrate. We're all homies here. <laughs> also, Gecko, thank you for the shout out to V. Y'all can check him out. The only can't kiss the homies goodnight. So long as they're okay with it. One of those is looking a little... That is the wrong layer. There we go. <laughs> Tank trouble. Wish I could even hug my homies, but they all live in other states and countries. Just gotta send out some virtual hugs. Be tired. I died 42 times to the Guardian Monkey in Sekiro and I feel ashamed. Oh no. I'm sorry, V. The Guardian Monkey's a really fun fight though. I do. I love it so much. Um, don't look at my playthrough of the first Sekiro game. Uh, <laughs> especially for the monkey. <laughs> You did beat it though. That's a big one, V. Good job. You beat the monkey. That's good. Hard to do. It's a hard game to play. Nah, y'all ain't my homies. We ain't gone out to eat or played games together. That's fair. Homies means different things to different people. Also, Mr. Snack. Thank you for the resub. Be 14 months. Oh, welcome back. Kind of perfect. The hand tracking motion is so cool. Thank you. I definitely- I did not uh, write the software for this. This is by Virtual Grace. I only drew the art assets for it. Alright, let's drop. No? I love that my hockey's oh, There we go. Perfect. Who's a buy? Yeah, I think the monkey fight is what made me give up points gambling in the channel, if I remember. Yeah. Well, <laughs> so when I streamed that monkey fight, I beat it first try. <laughs> yeah, Gecko was. <laughs> I was like, yeah, just before I end stream, let's give it a shot. I don't know if I'll be able to beat him. And then I beat him in one try, and I was like, that was fun. Um. <laughs> Fighting two at the same time, though. 
That's a rough one. That is a real rough one. They're so hard to fight together. B, I'm seething right now. I mean, I, t I told you you weren't gonna wanna know. <laughs> First it was Holloway, now it's Sekiro. I'm so sorry, I'm embarrassing this cat. <laughs> Solo Guardian name James too hard once you learn how to dodge. Yeah, it's not too bad. But this is a fight with. Have fun. <laughs> Guys, I thought my 10k points would be safe on the first try. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> uh, Lily was right. That was the one where Lily was like, yep. You can win first try. <sighs> After losing a fight 20 times in a row. Yeah, I did struggle a bit during that stream, but then the Guardian 8 fight was very easy. Out if I want to do ray bands or if I want to do fake sunglasses that don't exist but I can draw them. Just draw whatever we vibe with, whatever the pen decides it wants. Pointy eyes, let's go. Going for sexy librarian glasses. Oh, these are. Also, Moto Mouse, thank you for the Risa. Happy six months. Hi, honey, how's your day going? It's doing, going real good. My mom bought me a lot of food from Costco, and now I have to make a lot of meals. So I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna be making a lot of food tomorrow. It'll be fun. Kathy, I walks in. Are you winning, honey? Yeah, pa. I'm doing great. That's not what glasses look like. Come on. How do you draw glasses? I don't really know how to draw glasses now that I think about it. Uh oh. I didn't do prop. I never learned how to draw props. Aren't sexy librarian glasses much thinner than that? I think so. I don't think these are sexy librarian glasses. These are like pointed librarian glasses. Uh. <laughs> I can relate. I beat Orphan of Coast uh, first try. To this day, my roommates who watch me still do not believe me. <laughs> Sometimes it just, it just happens. Like the stars aligns. Your muscle memory kicks in. You just beat up a video game boss without even trying, and you're like, oh, have I become a god in this world? Perhaps. Yeah, that's kind of how I felt when uh, Cove and I were playing Bloodborne. I was like, I've already played this. I can't beat the boss. You gotta beat the boss. I want I want to see, I want to show off all the cool bosses. You don't see reference. Oh, you're right. I should use reference, but look, they're already half done, and I don't feel- I don't like drawing props. <laughs> I don't feel like drawing props. I don't really want to go to work today. Uh... Drawing props is hard. Background and prop artist. True legend. Honey's always winning. She's us looking after her and giving her love and support. Listen, this is very true. I'll uh, <laughs> having y'all here and supporting me. That's that's the only win I need. Neko, honey, I need to recharge my batteries. Animation takes time. Oh my gosh, animation does take time. It sucks. But yeah, take it easy, Neko. Get some rest. I will see you soon. I'm excited to see your art. Your art's always so amazing to see. I said it before, I'll say it again, Neko. One day you will surpass me. It'll probably be sooner than you think. Storm! Uh? 
In the most recent session of D&D, I've been doing with friends in a story where I had a tiefling sorcerer and druid who also had a draconic ancestry, and soon I intend to introduce my wood elven warrior Rain Willowing later, but currently debating on what voice to give him. Going between Sonic 2 movies, Knuckles voice, or Kirby right back at you, Meta of Night voice. Ooh. I feel like Knuckles would be really fun. Oh. No skin, no reference now. Set up demo. Good artist to have us, but dude, uh, I know you're right. I know you're right, but, but I don't wanna. But I don't wanna. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to. <laughs> I didn't. I, well, I meant to. I didn't mean to sound that bad. <laughs> And you gotta learn how to dress still life eventually. No, active life only. I ended up beating the Necro Dancer in Cadence Hyrule in the first try. Silver, early you mentioned you played Soulsborne games. Yep, I have played all of the Soulsborne games except for Demon Souls. And I haven't finished Dark Souls 2, but we're not gonna talk about that one. Sorry, those of you who like Dark Souls 2, I can't play through it. It's. You know what? Maybe. Maybe one day I'll play through it. Maybe I'll I'll do a drinking sip. Every time I die, I'll take a sip and we'll try to get through Dark Souls 2 within six or seven streams. Maybe like long streams. Dark Souls 2 is connected to Elden Ring in a messed up way, also I haven't been close. I don't have a PS5. Can't play Demon's. You don't reference right now, I'm gonna give you <laughs> I... I... Okie dokie. I will. Oh. <laughs> Neko, I just saw what you did. It's amazing. I love it. Anyways, I got distracted. Right, I was looking up reference for a... a... sunglass. Yeah, that's what I was looking for. Sunglasses. Sunglasses. Aha! No. Not the one I was looking for. Come on. Come on. No, you'll die. What if? Would y'all make fun of me if I wore this to a beach? <laughs> to protect my privacy, of course. And, and from the sun. Yes. I love Turtle Pope. Yep. Goblet's tan. Yep, we made a beat. We can tan. I still have a Bloodborne too. No, I'm not waiting for it. I feel like it's it was it was excellent, almost perfect game for me. Um, the diving dungeons I didn't like too much, but that's because they were very repetitive, and that's just me. They were fine though. Because when I heard randomized dungeon, I was like, oh. Mazes and it was a maze except for that each all of them like each one of them looked kind of the same. Where is that? Oh wait wait. Ah got it. Oh wait, wait, wait. Ah. Got it. There we go. There we go. So if I do this, this, wrong color. Oh, the curve around the head. Ah, uh, yep. Okay. Grab these. 
How accurate are they? Not. I think I gotta make it smaller. That's not too bad. It could be better. Bad, not bad. The goblin tent, they could look like an avocado. Depends on the type. I want a bunch of different colors. Our sister is better with a friend who knows the game, knows it like the back of their hand. Oh, wait, be a volunteer. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Hmm. Ah, uh, this is just Dark Souls 2. Ah! Urge, hi! How's it going? Actually, you're an amazing stream. Some people love you, keep doing a good job. Thanks, Mr. Max. That's very kind of you. I spell it other possibly, but would you prefer to fight a walking mushroom that punches hard or a pot that punches hard? What? I guess? Yeah, probably a pot, because I feel like with enough force you could smash it, but with a mushroom. It could just take that. If I swung a bat into it, it could just take it. Hey, sir. I stepped out for a bit. Who are we doing? How are we doing on the swimsuit gobble? Doing pretty good. Just doing sunglasses right now. Just trying to work out the perspective on it. God, I just think it needs to be. I love it. Yeah, something like that. That looks a bit better. Almost like a headband. Is it avocado? For Shavak, dude. Oh, that's an old theme. Do arrows scare you? Can't think of why they would. But nah. This cute gob at the beach and you want to talk to her. What do you say? Hmm, good question. I feel like if I want to make things not weird, I usually look at them and go and find something to compliment, like, hey, your hair looks really good, or like, hey, yeah, the swim you have good chase in swimsuits. Usually if I want to talk to someone, yeah, I just, I give them compliment first, so that they can just say thanks, and then we can both move on afterwards, or like, they can start a conversation from there. I leave it to them. You sing verbatas into a bar of soap shower, does that soap then become a opera soap opera? <sighs> oh, that reminds me, I got some good soaps. Try soon. I gotta use up my old soaps though. Can't keep opening new bars of soap. Can't justify it. I think that's pretty good. I'll do for now. I can work on a little bit off stream. Maybe I'll work on it a bit on Monday. Who knows? Also, Odin King, thank you for the brief and posture check. Excuse me. <laughs> it's cute. I've been wanting to draw some suits for a while. All right, let's go back here. <laughs> Donnie, thank you for the ear wiggles. <laughs> also, Black Blood, thank you for the resub. Happy seven months. Welcome back. Whew. What would goblin soap even smell like? Probably earthy, like clay. That's what most of us are like. Yeah, I call the goblin a dork, but then also call it. It's a double-edged sword. That's not the right word for it, is it? I think my brain's tired. Who is dying? Hi, you're very pretty. That's also that also works. Um, I don't know. It's it's hard to approach people in public 
Especially when you're like not sure how to start a conversation. Like, best case, you pay them a compliment and then the conversation starts. But like, if you just pay them a compliment, worst case, they'll just give you a weird look and then you can be like, oh, okay, cool, my bad, I'll walk away now. Am I at? Alexander felt like a sack of potatoes in one part with things. Trying my best to just both quest lines from Elden Oh, gotcha. I haven't finished Elden Ring, so. Appreciate it. Soon. I'll draw abs. Oh, I love drawing abs. It's so much fun. Goblin stuff would smell like gold. Gold smells... Gold just smells like metal. Like, softer metal. That makes sense. Not a particularly good fragrance for your skin. Wah. Follow guy, but he's going pretty good. I'm just vibing. I just finished up doing some art. I'm just cooling down a little bit, taking it easy. I think Goblin Silk can smell like fresh dirt, dug dirt. Berries and tree sap. Oh, yeah, berries is another one. Tree sap's fine, but that's like syrup. Still very looking forward to future stream. Now I'm streaming Path of Pain tomorrow. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be a lot of fun. I'm gonna get mad, so it's gonna be okay. So long as I take a moment to compose myself after every death, should be fine. Should be. That's that's the cop. Yeah, good. Death. Be meeting new people. Hi, I like anime. Do you? No. Okay, I'll go with friend. I. Don't, it's it's hard to start off with. Do you like anime? Unless you're like an in an anime club. I hope the sound alerts are sounding off, because, like, I couldn't hear it over the music. Listen, I did not expect that my message would be read. Whoops. But what you type, it might just be read by people. <laughs> ah. Salty goblin. I will be salty tomorrow. But you know what? Maybe, if I'm expecting it, and going into Path of Pain with that mentality, maybe I won't be. Maybe I'll be nice and calm, you know? Be like, say lovey, that's life. And then add another to my death counter. Fun fact, because gold has no natural oxidizes. oxides, it typically has no scent. <laughs> Doesn't it smell a little like metal? I haven't sniffed gold close enough. Oh god, now I'm afeard. As you should. I'll be. Angelic, just popping in to say hi. Sorry, I missed the first bit of the stream. No worries. Take it easy. All good. Everyone here is loved and appreciated. Very true. Y'all gotta make sure you take care of yourselves. Hey, if you're looking for someone to read, Angel Steps is currently playing Genshin. Let me check who's on, actually. Also, Death, thank you so much. Well, this was the first time in a long time I stayed for the whole stream. Real quick question, chat. Do we forget any V Shoujo members to give subs to? Ah, uh, I think you're good. I do know which ones you missed, but I will not say it. Sorry, I'm just checking and making sure that no one's ending the stream. Can you be disappointed by the lack of saltiness? Perhaps. Also, I see you're not reading the message for us to call you cute. What? What message? I didn't. I missed it and not looked at chat. Fine. Thank you, Scrub. Don't miss the stream. Oh, well, at least you got to see the news coverage. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Uh, salt just makes sweeter. Salt and sweet go well together. Peanut butter? Anybody? Peanut butter, good. Can't escape your obliga- oh, Dang it! Y'all knew who it was. Dad, thank you for the gifted sub to Fruit. And, no, thanks for the gifted sub to Project Melody. Do Ms. Vipate? 
That's okay. That's okay. Peanut butter. I love soup. I love peanut butter. Oh, I love peanut butter. I was about to say I love soup, which I do. Mom got me. You got me like spicy soup. <gasps> Salted caramel. Yes. Next No, we're not gonna start that hashtag. We're not gonna start that hashtag. Perno added sugar. Yeah, that's pretty. Good. Like I understand that. Sometimes peanut butter by itself is really good with no added sugar. All right, honey, this is the daily reminder that you have to read this message where I call you cute. It's part of the bravery training for the adorable goblin who is worthy of all call. No. You can't make me accept it. Also, Janoski, yeah, we're wrapping up. I have to get to bed. I have to, well, first off, I have to clean some dishes because I had dinner right before stream. And then I got to sleep because tomorrow, I'm gonna be doing something that's gonna make me mad, but also gonna be really fun. So, we're gonna see how it goes. I'm just jamming to this playlist right now. Or the hashtag chat, you know. That's <laughs> good. John, you don't like peanut butter? Hmm. No, I've never met anyone who doesn't like peanut butter. You are a rare one. Good night, Cities. Thanks for dropping by. Can you quickly go back to your sketch? I'm gonna add the swimsuit to my gobs. Yeah, sure. Let me just quickly go back to the sketch. Trapmaster. Oh yeah, there's a lot of people on right now. I am just making. I think. I'm just making sure I know this person because, like, I don't want to send y'all to someone who I might not know and I might make you uncomfortable. So let me just check. How do you think we will ever let you forget you cute? How can I forget when you keep reminding me? Ooh, all right. I think I found someone who is streaming that doesn't usually stream around my time. <laughs> We're gonna say hi to him. Or, hmm, oh, oh, I'm a bit torn. Yeah, this person might have it. Okay, who J? Oh, there's so many cool people on right now. Yeah. Well, <laughs> didn't even decide that was the raid message. Come on. Also, Renix, thank you for the gift of sub to Momo. And Arthur, thank you for the hydrate. Let's go visit this person then. We're gonna visit. Um... Now I do not know them very well, uh, just as a forewarning, but they are doing a subathon, so let's go visit uh, Angel Steps. I do not know them very well, but I like to do some singing, and they gotta go voice. Please wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Give me a sec. I'm trying to- I'm trying to do this. I keep spelling it angle. There you go, they're playing Genshin. Alright. Also, Janowski! <laughs> Thanks for the gift this up to Connor. I don't think Connor knows who I am. <laughs> I would be very surprised. I love his stuff though. I listen to Trash Taste a lot. Fun. Also, Killer, thank you for the pre-sub with Prime. Welcome back. I guess we're going with that raid message, huh? Alright. <laughs> if, if that's what it's meant to be. Also, Cotton, hi! We're just wrapping up streams. Sorry about that. Timing-wise, it didn't work out. My bad. Let's go. They're doing a subathon right now, so... Be sure to just uh, have a good time. Be respectful. I know you all are all pretty respectful, anyways. Y'all are good beans. I will see you tomorrow. 
at 9 a.m. PDT. That's also that's noon EST. Half a pain, baby. Let's go. I'm super excited. It's gonna be fun. Y'all have fun. Thank you so much for today. I will see you soon. Get some rest and make sure you drink some water. Bye-bye.